All right, all right, all right. Welcome. Yeah. Another week. Yes, we're back again. <laughs> again, we are the uh the Holy Wood Squares. I'm sorry, no, 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 no. We're not the Holy Wood Squares. We the <laughs> We the elders of, elders of Israel and uh we have another class for you all. Uh we're gonna have a very interesting class today. And the reason it's interesting is because I got a question from my mother. <laughs> my mother asked me, what does tithes and offering mean? And then after she asked me, somebody else asked me. So I had to go in conference with my fellow Elder <laughs> King, your hand. Shalom. <laughs> Elder King. <laughs> and I said, look here, bro. <laughs> now the most high, you know that scripture where the most high, whenever uh, uh, Joseph interpreted that dream for that Pharaoh, mm -hmm. he said, the most high gave you that dream twice to <laughs> signify that he mean what he's saying. It's gonna yeah. come to pass. Yeah, yeah. I said, yeah. look here, bro. You the one started the controversy <laughs> with it. Cause you put that precept <laughs> on the screen. Last video. Why did he put it on the screen? What happened? So right. now we're gonna take the time to explain to you what tithes and offerings are. Yes. Okay. Here's a little hint. It ain't money. Nah. Well, and, no. uh, hold on. It's not money how you think. It is money. Yes. But not how you think. Not how you all think. Right, all right. Not carnal. Right. It you know, ain't carnal money. In this class today, you're going to understand <laughs> the money in the system. You're going to understand it all, all today. You're going to get the seventh day on it. Okay. All so, crazy. before we go through that, there's some things that I, I've seen. I'm going to share something with you. Um, let me see. I want you guys to pay attention to get your thought going, okay? This is from our neighbors, right? Mm. This is the doctrine that they put out, okay? So let's watch what our neighbors had said. You guys can see this on the screen? Can you guys see this? Mm -hmm. I want you to listen to what was being said. To love the Lord and those who hit the Lord. You know, I'm talking about uh, First John. So listen to what this brother said about First John good. three fifteen. Because sometimes, sometimes it's good to win these things out. Talking about hit your brother. Go ahead. Because at the end of the day, <laughs> this is one thing we're gonna have to understand, brothers. We're gonna have to understand how the how the whole thing, how God made the whole thing. Then we cannot be confused. Because we love somebody. You understand? Because we're using emotion and feeling, trying to deal with things that need reason. You cannot deal with feeling and emotion to deal with reason. That's impossible. You got it? I'm glad he First said that. John chapter 3, verse 15. Whosoever hateth his brother is a murderer. Read that thing again, brother. Whosoever hateth his brother is a murderer. You see that whosoever hit his brother is a murder. Brothers is playing. They're thinking that they're hitting us. They're not realize you hitting God. Because we didn't brought ourselves to that level. Christ did. So when you go against the prophet of God, you go against God. <laughs> That's how stupid brothers can be. Mm -hmm. But when you love your brother, brother, would you set your camp next to your brother? So this is a response the to them that? fighting on the street. There's no love in there, brother. So instead of saying we're both wrong, hatred. he trying to blame the other person. All we're seeing is envy. All we're seeing is strife. But then All they do that to the division. Christian church. Right. Listen to this. Listen to this, though. You know, the whole thing. You know what the whole thing is about? We what is it about, Lavica? Oh. Sum it up to money. Mm -hmm. Money. 
If I get rid of IUIC, look how many people I'm going to get. One dollar, two dollar, four dollar, five dollar, six dollar, eight dollar, ten dollar. Oh, I forget the nine dollar. That's how stupid people really are, bro. They will sell the soul to the damn devil for a dollar who don't have no value. Go ahead, my brother. And ye know that no murderer hath eternal life abiding in him. Read that again, brother. And ye know that no murderer hath eternal life abiding in him. When you I want to stop that there. <clears throat> yeah. Did you just see what he just said? Yes. He basically told everybody that they are money. Yes. So IUIC yeah. is the head moneymaker. Yes. So all the other camps are only competing with IUIC because of money. I hope you guys are starting to see this. It's starting to get your understanding what ties and offers. Uh, he specifically said, <laughs> you know what they see. $1, $2, $3, $4, $5, $6, $7, $8, oh, I forgot eight. He see those people as money. That's it. That's coming well, from straight out of his mouth. There ain't also, nobody telling you that. That He said that. Didn't he, didn't he teach the people to hate the white man? Yeah. Yes, he did. Yes. Isn't the mm -hmm. white man your brother? Yeah. Isn't the Chinese man your brother? Yes. Isn't the African man your brother? Yes. Let me bring up one scripture, Elder. Now, uh, let, let's go mm -hmm. to Genesis 29 and verse 4. Let's see what Jacob called those men, what he began to teach those men. One of the progenitors. Mm -hmm. What did Abraham do? What did Isaac do? Yes. Read it. Genesis 29, 4. And Jacob said unto them, Stop. Plural. Them, 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 them. Esau is not in the picture right here. Read. Right. My brethren. My brethren. My brethren. I bet you everybody Bible that M is capitalized. Mm -hmm. My brethren. Read. Whence be ye? Read. And they said, of Haran are we. You see that? Oh, another nation, not, yep. not of Israel. Not they teach of Israel. a different doctrine. Right. Yes. Mm -hmm. Iran is a different doctrine. Yes. So it's even people who are not mm -hmm. of your same doctrine, they are your brethren. You're supposed That's to talk them. Mm -hmm. You're supposed to talk them. You're supposed right. to talk them. The teacher's going to get the worst treatment. James so, 3 and 1. So now, now we're in Genesis, right? Mm -hmm. And 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 Labaka said that there's money. So he said one dollar, two dollar, three dollar. So what did God command you from the beginning? How did he said you supposed? How was you supposed to learn his word? Anybody know? Does anybody know how he's supposed to learn his word? Can we read this, please, Elder? Let's get the yeah. commandment on this thing. Genesis chapter two, verse sixteen. And the Lord God commanded the man, saying, Of every tree of the garden thou mayest freely eat. No, with money. Mm. Freely eat. That's what yes. it says. It says freely. Mm -hmm. You're not supposed to be charging money for the word. No. Right. Next. Oh. Period. That's but, a commandment from God. That's it. Read. But the tree of the knowledge of good and evil, thou shalt not eat of it. Mm -hmm. You should not learn that. Read. For in the day that thou eatest thereof, thou shalt surely die. Because he only wanted you to learn spiritual. He didn't want you in that carnal space. Mm -hmm. That's why he said to know good and evil, because he only wanted you to know good. What, mm -hmm. well, what we started one. We wanted to go into extra doctrines. What that mean? Convert. 
Yes, you're gonna convert to that carnal fools. That's what he's telling right. you. He right. wanted you to stay spiritual. If you go up there and start learning that carnal foolishness, it's gonna convert you. That's what he just told you. Right. He told Adam, "You oh, Adam. walking dead." So now we're gonna go. Let's go. To, let's go to. Uh, let's go with Paul. Let's get what Paul says. What we supposed to? How we supposed to learn this word? First Corinthians two and twelve. First Corinthians chapter two, verse twelve. Uh huh. Now we have received not the spirit, but spirit. The word. Mm -hmm. the spirit word. is the word, not the word of the world, <laughs> but the word which is of God. Uh -huh. See that? Yeah. All right. Yeah. We just translated that. <laughs> that we might know. That we might know the things that are freely given to us of God. So, are we supposed to be paying for anything when it comes to the Word of God? No. no. We're supposed to get that no. knowledge and wisdom freely. for freely. free. So yeah. now, let's get it three times. Let's get out of Christ's own mouth. We're supposed to follow Christ, am I correct? Yes. We're followers of Christ. Yes, so let's sir. see what Christ say about it. Mm -hmm. Wow. Because we may be, we, you know, let's get some more witnesses on. Let's get the witness right here, Christ. This is a command, right? What did you say? Read that, please, Elder. Matthew chapter 10, verse 7. And as ye go, preach, saying, the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Telling that you have Christ's doctrine. Mm -hmm. That's what you're telling me. Oh. Heal the sick. Correct the doctrines. <laughs> Cleanse the lepers. Correct the teachers. Raise the dead. Raise those that's in the earth, that's in that carnal understanding. Raise them back to life, back to God. Oh, wow. Now, now, that right there, now, it's telling you. That 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 young lady, Lazarus, he mm -hmm. raised them up to a higher understanding. Mm -hmm. Cause he giving you authority to, to do that also, to yes. raise them up to a higher understanding. Mm -hmm. Heal the sick, heal the sick. Now so it's a multitude of sickness. Uh, right. You can write down Mark chapter one, verse thirty-two. It's a All spiritual disease now. Right. The plague oh, yeah. doctrines. Yep. Yes. Yes. The plague doctrines. Yes. Raise the dead. Take them from that carnal up into Jerusalem. Raise them Raise up. up. Yes. Up. Up. Cast out devils. Correct those th who are lying to you. <laughs> Freely you have received. Uh huh. Uh -oh. Freely give. Freely teach it. Yes. yes. As free as you got it, as free as you're supposed to give it. That's yes. right. So show yes. me where we don't got three scriptures Old Testament and New Testament. It it's showed a, you that you're supposed to not pay for the word of God. Let let me get one. It's, a, it's, it's another scripture. Let right. me get one, El. Go ahead, El. Revelation 21 and 6. Because okay. we're covering the whole Bible. Say, put on the whole arm of God, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we went from the, the New Testament all the way to the last book. <laughs> the, I mean, the, 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 the <laughs> Old Testament all the way to the last book. Mm hmm. Revelation 21 and 6. And he said unto me, <clears throat> It is done. I am Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. He said, And I was here before you got here, and I'll be here when you're not here. Right. Read. I will give unto him that is a thirst. This water, Ephesians 5 26. Of the fountain of of the water of John life 4 14. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. of life freely 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 and, and 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 this is another thing here <clears throat> remember this is not man's doctrine this right. is god's doctrine oh, there's that scripture in the bible it it, it says that the Most High brought the word. Great is it a publisher? The them that published it. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. he is his word. 
it's in Psalms. Um, it's, it's the Psalms, most highest words. Some, I think Psalms forty. <clears throat> It's the most highest word. So what these men doing, they going and they taking his word and they're stealing it, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. <clears throat> and then they're selling most highest word that they stole to those mm -hmm. people Christ by charging that. tithes. Christ Y'all see that? that? Yes, yes, sir. Mm -hmm. I see you know man. Yeah. Yeah. He, yeah. he said he going to cast lots for my garment. They going to yes. make money off my top. Yeah. Yes. That's what that's what Jesus was saying. They're going to cast lots for my top. There you go, Elder. The Lord gave the word. Great was the company of those that published it. So those who published it was the prophets who wrote these books, right? right. But the prophets did not charge the people. No. For the understanding, they no. didn't do that. No, they didn't you see that. But then came along that wicked prophet that saw mm -hmm. the benefit yeah. of that carnal doctrine. All right, he the guy who came up and then he started saying, "Well, you know, I can actually raise my status with this carnal doctrine if I can get these people to believe they got to pay." in order to get salvation. And they, and they stole God's flock. Yes. By that con mm -hmm. interpretation. Go, yes. go to, go to, I got one more. Go to John mm -hmm. 7 and 16. Because we keep saying it's God's doctrine. Yes. Okay. Let's hear it from Christ. Since they talking about they follow Christ. Okay. Mm -hmm. Buddy. <laughs> sure, buddy. Sure, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. John chapter 7 verse 16 Jesus answered them and said my doctrine is not mine who did he say he said not mine mm -hmm. he said it, it belonged to somebody else guess who it belonged to <laughs> Mosai so, okay I want but, them viewers to ask that they're they playing with God's flock mm -hmm. okay he said it's not even <laughs> mine but Read. he is that sent me. Okay. I don't know if y'all fear God, but I know I'm terrified of him. I'm terrified of him. He said, Sam, mm -hmm. you ain't got to be scared. I said, well, most I, I just want to make sure that you know I'm still terrified of right. you. I love you. <laughs> right. I'm terrified of you, boss man. <laughs> if any, If any man will do his will. His will. His will is totally different from Carl. Psalms 40, verse 8. Write that down. His commandments. It ain't no carnal. Read. He shall know of the doctrine. You see that? So it's something other than carnal. Read. Whether it be of God or whether I speak of myself. See, he taught in the synagogue. John chapter 18, verse 18 and 19. He said, I spoke mm -hmm. in the synagogue. Why you don't understand me, Pharisee? I taught where the Jews resorted. You're not right. mine. If so, mm -hmm. if you don't understand the spiritual interpretation, guess what? Read chapter Romans chapter eight again. You're not his. Right. Yes. Go to the next so, verse. Right. <clears throat> he that's John chapter seven verse eighteen. He that speaketh of himself seeketh his own glory. Mm. Oh my God! Now that that you cutting it up right now, you know, <laughs> hey, <go ahead. laughs> speak up, hey, cause he caught him. Everybody see right. that caught him. You need yeah, to learn yeah. the parables. You need mm -hmm. to learn the parables, sonny boy. He got his Read. own doctrine. Mm -hmm. Yes, but he that seeketh his glory, he's a that... light bearer. Glory means light. Mm -hmm. His glory, John chapter eight verse twelve. He, Christ is the light. This one is a light bearer. Wake up, I U I C. Wake up. Read. But he <laughs> seeketh his glory that sent him. The same is true. Read. And, and no unrighteousness is in him. See that? Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. So I'll praise the most. I'll praise the most high. What what That's did right. what did what did my man say? He said it was about money, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right. 
So let's yeah. let's deal with that. Let's deal with the money, right? Let's deal. Let's prove Lavaca for a second. What do you say, Elder? Can we please read the beautiful bean footage? First mm-hmm. Timothy chapter six, verse three. Uh huh. If any man teach otherwise. So what is we the thought we're having about? We're talking about teaching, teaching. All right? Mm-hmm. Yes. And consent not to wholesome words. Uh huh. Here can you explain the wholesome words right after this comma? Even the words of our Lord Jesus Christ. Even even the words of our Lord Jesus Christ. So now you're speaking his doctrine, right? Read. Yep. And to the doctrine which is according to godliness. Because you're going to take two precepts and you're going to understand how to break down the parables. That's the doctrine. The parables of, of this Bible is a doctrine. The mysteries. Right? He is proud. That dude is proud if he can't break down the, the parables. Read. Knowing nothing. <laughs> Keep going. But doting about questions and strifes of words. Of what? Words. Of words. Because they can't be they're inconsistent in their breakdowns. Mm. Like when they got a poster now that say, I think I have it. They say that, they're, that the water is the word, right? Mm-hmm. They're sitting here saying that they're the water. Yes. Right? The next thing you know, they the water ain't the word. Yeah. Now Christ. they call themselves. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Christ walked on water now. He literally right. walked on water. Now he, he, see- he's saying the water, the word, but now Christ walked on water. Yeah, yeah. My, Moses stood on the bank of that, 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 that shore mm-hmm. and he put that staff down. That thing split in half. But the water, <laughs> the word, brother, you just said it. Mm-hmm. But you're not consistent. Yes. Right. Right. Now you believe in the supernatural foolishness. Everybody think Moses is one of the super friends. Come on, bro. (laughs) Come on, man. Right. (laughs) You got it, Elder. What is he saying? The water. Well, why he in the water? <laughs> now he the water. <laughs> you see that? He oh still, my you god! See, you see how they they use them old wives here? Cause they go sit oh. there and they go. They got him oh. standing like he's he standing on the water. Oh you see what god. I'm saying? Like he wow. Christ, right? Wow. So now yep. they teaching that that uh Jewish fable that Christ yeah. walked on water. Oh my mm-hmm. God. In the same sentence, he's saying the word is the water. But he giving you the impression that a man can walk on water. Mm. I see it, right? But he I won't be. explain yes. what it means. So they got the people <laughs> up there. That's how the most I say they're thieves. They mm-hmm. stealing wow. these people's salvation because yes. they won't explain it. They won't right. explain it. They, 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 yeah. Just a bunch of thieves. So the people mm. believe a bunch of foolishness, thinking that a man can walk on water. You know? Come on, so, man. Uh, that's crazy. Yeah. But now, yeah, you see, now you see it. See? Mm-hmm. We don't have to make this stuff up while people, we're not gossip camp. They all that they say all that foolishness. It's not about that. It's what they're doing. That's mm-hmm. a distraction. Because they don't want to. We done already told them. Look here, brother. Name the time, name the place. They run it. Mm-hmm. Just, just let you know. Okay, just like, just like them, them apologetics ran them off that block. They've been running. They like, uh, oh, you know, do, uh, <laughs> you know, some of you old school folks know who, uh, what a bad name was Antonio Tarver. Whatever mm-hmm. he went up there, and told <laughs> Roy Jones. He said, Roy, when are you going to stop running? Stop from fighting me? me, Roy. When you going to give me a chance? <laughs> Roy got mad. <laughs> And he ended up fighting. But these these cowards ain't never going to debate nobody because they know that doctrine that they got is a lie. These people lie. know it now. We ain't even got to say nothing. Oh, we we, we going to bring that out later. Yeah. We're going to bring that. Yeah. But go ahead, Elder. I'm sorry, uh, right? No, we're, we're fine. <laughs> I, I love that the fact that we're going in because it's what right. we're supposed to do. <clears throat> Absolutely. So we'll go right back to this uh, second. That's First Timothy. All right. So start at the top. First Timothy, chapter six, verse four. He is proud, mm-hmm. knowing nothing. They nothing. don't know nothing about this Bible. Mm-hmm. Right. <laughs> it clear and evident. Nothing. Mm-hmm. Nothing. But doting about questions and strifes mm-hmm. of words. Where so, uh, 
We just seen that, right? So now that that brings up question and strikes. Because somebody will come up and say, well, 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 Deacon, water is the word because you just brought it here in Ephesians 5 26. But like Elder said, now Moses split, uh, uh, carnally split the Red Sea. See you there? Yep. You, you get what I'm saying? So now it's mm -hmm. uh, it, it, they keep mixing. That's yes. what is doting the question. So people keep mm -hmm. questioning and it's causing what confusion. Yes. God is not yeah. the author of confusion. Right. That okay. means if you confused by what that man's saying, he mm -hmm. ain't of God. That's right. what he's saying. To and fro on the earth. To yeah. and fro. Uh, oh, like we used to say back in the day. Say, look at old slew foot there. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all know who old slew foot is. Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's him sitting up mm -hmm. there confusing them people. Right. Thereof comes envy, strife, mm -hmm. railings, arguments. That's what you're seeing on the street. That's what you're seeing on the street. The strife and the railings, the envy. And then he just say all these other mm -hmm. people looking at us because of money. Mm -hmm. yes. That's where envy coming from. Mm -hmm. We, we gonna get all of it. It's gonna get all the way. Gonna get out until eleven. Evil surmising. <laughs> yeah. Evil so that's doctors, that's what yes. he. That, yeah. That's what. But that's that's what he's doing. Whenever he's sitting up, they want us because of the, that's that's a, you surmising that that's why they want you. You ain't gave no proof. You just surmising right. that oh yeah you know they want us because of this da 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 da. But in the in the in the time period where you're doing that, you're insulting the people because you calling them rubes. Mm -hmm. We're calling them people foolish. Yeah, we getting that money from them, and they too stupid to know we getting that money from them. We don't see them as nothing but a dollar. That's All that right. evil surmising he doing. That's what he doing. He made. He just did it with yes. that statement. Perverse disputings of men of corrupt minds. So now that's a perverse disputing when they're fighting on the street, isn't that mm -hmm. not? Yeah, yes. isn't that a perverse? Y'all supposed to be lifting up black folks, black <laughs> Hispanics, mm -hmm. and Native Americans, mm -hmm. and you just set them back a hundred years by fighting in the street. Well, they fight. getting lifted up. They getting lifted up quite well. They right. flying all over the world with them yeah. fine landings on. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> Why is it the people, if people have been following you and you've been promising all these many years about what you're going to do for these people, right? Mm -hmm. And then you look and you see things ain't got no better. The children are coming up now worse than the generation before mm -hmm. them. But mm -hmm. y'all done been in these streets and doing all this stuff. And it ain't just IUSC. It's all these politicians and all that other stuff mm -hmm. telling you, well, vote for me. I'm going to do mm -hmm. this and that and the other. And then whenever the time comes, you know, well, the white man didn't do this. The white man did. Well, the white man oh, ain't sitting the on the city council. Oh, it was the Republicans. It was the Democrats. It was the Republicans. They ain't sitting on it's the city council. They, right. they, what they did is they went and they conv uh, convinced you to give them authority over you and mm -hmm. your money. But oh, whenever it comes time to show and prove, ain't nobody got no answers. So right. you worse off now than you was whenever you started voting for them. Just like these people here sitting up in there saying y'all was in the Christian church and y'all was y'all was paying the paying the preacher all this money and all this other yes. stuff. Then you look around, all of a sudden you got to take a second mortgage out on your house to make Passover. Mm -hmm. Or to go over mm -hmm. there to feast the That's tabernacles. True. You got to buy all mm -hmm. this stuff. You got to travel halfway across the across the United States in order to attend their feasts and all this other mm -hmm. stuff. And then you look and you see, you start looking like, you know, hey, well, I done jumped out the frying pan into the fire because the they're doing the same exactly. thing. Yes. And whenever you ask for the results, uh, where are they at? They uh, become offended because why yes. are you uh, why are you asking about it? Yes, you're gonna yes. see it eventually. Right. right. But uh, why are you asking me? I'm supposed to do it. I'm supposed to blah blah blah. I promise you. But yeah, why yeah. are you asking? Why are you requesting this? Yeah. Right. Right. Next thing you know, they're gonna tell you wait. On the Lord. Lord. Right on the Lord. Yeah. The Lord. Yeah. The Lord work in mysterious <laughs> ways. The Lord. The Lord will provide. He will provide. Yeah. Keep okay. praying. Keep praying. You finna mm -hmm. with that elder. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we, got, we got to go down to verse 11. Okay, verse 11. Okay. Okay. Perverse disputings of men with corrupt minds and mm -hmm. destitute of the truth. Meaning they're liars. Yes. Okay. 
supposing that gain is godliness. Hey, what is godless, godliness? <laughs> gain. Okay. So think about this, 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 this earth nowadays. Mm -hmm. You are God who has the most stuff. Mm -hmm. You have the most money to buy the most stuff. He just mm -hmm. said it out his mouth. The only reason why they're angry with us because they want money. Showing that you're the supreme God in that realm because we're making the most money. Mm -hmm. I hope y'all see what he's saying. Supposing that gain is godliness. Yes. Yeah. Riches. That's what he said. That money in your pocket. What mm -hmm. God say to do with that? What, what Paul said? Read. Keep reading. From such, withdraw thyself. You're supposed oh. to get away from that. Yes. Oh, run away. Run away. Yes. Wow. You going? But godliness is contentment. Godliness. Let me stop. <laughs> Let me say that again. Let me say that again. First Timothy chapter six, <laughs> verse six. But godliness with contentment is great gain. Meaning you're humble. Yes. You're yes. a humble person. You don't care to put just you don't care to put yourself on the thumbnails. Mm -hmm. It's not about King Yohanan. Mm -hmm. It's the elders of Israel and everybody who follow that. Yes. You don't put yourself one man above the crew. That's mm -hmm. right. That's why God told you don't put a king over you. Right. And you guys right. obviously did not follow that command. That's right. They built the molten image. Yes. Right. Mm -hmm. Yes. Verse seven. Yes. Well, we brought nothing into this world. Yep. And it is certain we can carry nothing out. So all them riches that you're doing, you taking everybody else's salvation. God yes. said you brought nothing in and you ain't carrying that stuff out. But you destroying other people for, for earthly doctrines. Econ economics is a doctrine. Yes. So to have the most stuff, he just read in the scripture above, if I have the most money, that makes me a God. So that economics is a doctrine. You brought, you didn't bring yes. that into this world and you shouldn't be carrying that out. That mm. thought process out. Covetousness. That's it. That's right what that there. is. That's covetousness. That's yes, a spiritual it's, lust. Yes. It's covetousness. He covered the man. He said, mm -hmm. thou shalt not cover thy neighbor. He covered the, the whole family. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and the doctrines. <laughs> yeah. God said he God said you don't sow just say it. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> That's right. You ain't sold his doctrine. Y'all sold right. y'all doctrine. You sold your doctrine. We're gonna get right. all of this today. Buy and sell, we're gonna get all of it today. Keep going, Ellen. <laughs> and having food and raiment, let us be there with content. Having food. What is the food, anybody? What is the food in the Bible? The allegory, the food. It's what? The word. It's the, the word. Yes. And the raiment is what? The word. The word. The word. Let yes. us be content with having the understanding. Yes. That's what he's telling you. Yes. Let you be have, humble with have the understanding. Have y'all heard in the Bible where any of them prophets didn't have what they needed? Most high always provided. Mm -hmm. yes. Always yes. provided, yes. man. Mm -hmm. always. always provided. Even whenever my, uh, Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. and them, when they was fighting for civil rights, the most high protecting them people. I know the man took the ultimate sacrifice, mm -hmm. but they was feeding mm -hmm. them people, man. Them people, yeah. them people wasn't wanting for nothing, man. Yeah, it was mm -hmm. a, a tough struggle, but the, yeah. they, they, they took care yeah. of their neighbor. The most high was providing mm -hmm. for the people. He put the spirit on them people to love mm -hmm. their brother. They was all together, man. That ain't what's mm -hmm. happening now. These dudes done went and they done took, started focusing on themselves. And they yes. don't care nothing about that flock. Mm -hmm. yeah. No, they don't care nothing about the flock. That's just mm -hmm. a show out. That's just a show out. It's just to help them create that old man in them all the time. That's yes. all. They mm -hmm. just join because they're angry and they, they got a reason mm -hmm. to be angry because they're in an angry group now. And the, the more the more the better they're angry and they think that's righteous. But see, yes. Habakkuk 1 and 4, he said he's going to turn everything upside down. Yes. And that's what he's done. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. He keeps pointing at, at the white man. You need to be pointing at him. Right, right. Because he's the one robbing you now. Yes. Mm -hmm. Right That's before true. your eyes. He yeah, got right. your mama. He got your daddy. He got your children. They getting dressed up. The man, they, they talking about, uh, they, about America 
Haiti is for sale for one dollar. <laughs> one dollar. Ninety nine point ninety nine point ninety nine nine point ninety nine percent of them black. Why aren't yes. you? Why aren't you over there? If you love black folks so much, you're here because you're robbing the people out of them. Right. Yes. Exactly. Yes. That's the reason. It's it's not about love. It's about right. dominating your own people, and that's right. what it's about. Yes. Robbing them out of their salvation. Yes. That's right. what it is. You don't love them. We saw you talk down to a, a widow woman. Yes. yes. And y'all still over there, hugged yeah. up on. Yes. A widow woman, and we call him everything, and he won't dare come over here. Right. <clears throat> Verse nine. Verse nine. But they that will be rich fall into mm. temptation and a snare. So the one that is everybody's wanting to get the one dollar, two dollar, three dollar, four is the rich man. Yes. Uh-huh. Right? He said that he shall fall into what? Temptation and the snare. Mm-hmm. Mm. And into what? And into many foolish and hurtful lusts doctrines the white man is the devil everybody mm-hmm. put you in slavery all these gentiles gonna pay for what they did uh, blah blah blah, yo, blah, yo, bro, you, blah. Can beat your brother up on the street and don't say sorry right hate is lustful that's a right. lust which drown men in destruction and perdition mm-hmm. here it Verse is 10. For the love of money is the root of all evil. That covetousness. Mm -hmm. Which while some coveted after, they have erred from the faith Mm -hmm. and pierced themselves through with sorrows. With many sorrows, those calamities. Those yes, calamities indeed. that come through, they erred in the faith. Yes. They're not keeping the doctrine of Christ. So they no. said, for the love of money is the root of all evil. Mm-hmm. So we have a situation. I'm going to explain you what this money is. And mm-hmm. also I'm going to give a law that these brothers should have had kept at the same time when those brothers were striving on the street, making a fool of themselves mm-hmm. and, and the word of God. They're supposed to be ambassadors. Yes. So I don't know what ambassador acts like that. Yes, supposed to be holy men. Holy men. God has stripped them down. Mm-hmm. So y'all scrapping in the street like fools. Yeah. Yes, so, holy men. Let's get the law on this. Let's let's just get the law. So now the dude brother said, "Well, the brother should not be or have the camp right next to the other brother." Blah blah blah. Brother, y'all both wrong. There's Lose. no right in that situation. No. No. Y'all sitting there trying to say that's just narcissism. You're trying to pay, place blame on somebody else. Y'all both wrong. Yes. And the sooner you realize that, the sooner you can repent. But you yes. can't do that because you're evil. And you're trying to always have yourself in this blameless state, which is just destroying you. That's the that's that that's that sorrow that you're getting from the last verse. But 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 the thing is, is if everybody can sit up in there and they can sit there and they talk about the brother shouldn't have did this, the brother shouldn't have did that, blah, 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 blah. Listen, those men are supposed to be prophets what's a prophet supposed to do the prophet supposed to go to the to the scriptures right. find a similitude of that happening right uh-huh. then he supposed to go and go to the most high with that parable to explain how to resolve but, that issue but they don't yeah. do that because no. there's a very famous story in the bible about lot and abram their mm-hmm. herdsmen fighting over doctrines. And it explains exactly how Abraham handled that situation. If you consider yourselves to be the quote unquote commanding general of Israel or the bishop of Israel or whatever title y'all done made up for y'all selves, you supposed to go and show them people what they need to do at the Bible. Because Abraham sought peace. He didn't come up in there 
beating his chest, talking about we tough and we ain't scared. Ain't no cows in this revolution and all that other stuff, inciting that stuff. Abraham said, brother, it's obvious the land can't, the land cannot bear both of us. So Abraham came up with a solution. You, are, is that what you're getting right now? Yeah, that's what I'm getting right now. Let's go ahead and get it. Let's read it. Read that first. I said Genesis 13 and 5. And Lot also, which went with Abram, had flocks mm -hmm. and herds mm -hmm. and tents. So letting you know, both Lot and Abram got two camps. Y'all see that? Mm -hmm. The camp got flocks. Yeah. That's the flocks. people. And he, he, and he got herds, right? That's all mm -hmm. of them people. And they got tents, right? So they got a lot of schools and all that other stuff. Y'all see that, right? This talking mm -hmm. about these people right here that we talking about. IUIC and ISUPK, who both of them about to go to war with one another right. without right. de-escalating. Go to the next right. verse. Reader. And the land was not able to bear them. They can't stay on the same block. Read. <laughs> that they might dwell together. See that? <laughs> Read. For their substance was great. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so that they could not dwell together. Both of them got the same doctrine. Hey. They're going to sit there and say, well, you know, our doctrine different than them, man. Both of y'all believe that. Jonah uh, lived in that well belly for three days. Both right. of y'all believe mm. Christ could walk on water. Y'all got mm -hmm. the same doctrine, which is the same doctrine as them Christians. They teach it the same way. Ain't no yes. difference between y'all. Mm -hmm. Read on. And there was a strife between the herdsmen of Abram's cattle mm -hmm. and the herdmen of Lot's cattle. One of Lot's cattle went and grabbed the chair. And Abraham Cowder went and pushed him out. You see what I'm saying? Y'all see what's going on here? Y'all see this? Oh, wow. Because I'm telling you, he ain't, he ain't got time for that foolishness of them lying men up in there trying to get their uh -uh. brother to hate one another. Yes. And whenever it get out of hand, they're going to say, we need to call for peace. Tell that to that man's family who's going to get hurt or right. somebody get killed out there. Because if that right. happened, all y'all going to jail because y'all criminal enterprises. Y'all yeah. mm -hmm. organized crime. Y'all idiots. Y'all don't even see how this thing, that thing say blood touches blood, man. Yeah. Right. Y'all know what's coming. Oh, you, right know. Stop. <clears throat> oh, you still on that. Yeah. yeah. And the Canaanite and the Perizzite well then in the land. Mm-hmm. Read on. So even if you think about this, if this says the Canaanite, that carnal, Mm -hmm. <laughs> Cain's yeah. doctrine mm -hmm. and the yeah. parasite doctrine dwell then in that in that land. So that's what well, they, they were both teaching. got. They both got common doctrines. They right. both got common doctrines. Yes, read on. And, and Abram said unto Lot, mm -hmm. "Let there be no strife." A Abram is the bigger man. He's the guy that loves his brother. He's willing to take a L, a loss, to have peace. He's teaching the, the doctrine of peace. Yes. Right. That's what separates Abram from the next guy. That's why the most high called him a friend. Abraham, Abram Bye. loved Bye. his brother. Yes. yes. Read on. I pray thee, between me and thee. He's mm-hmm. And between my herdmen and thy herdmen. Why? <laughs> For we be brethren. That's what the thing is. You guys are brothers, but you yes. hate your brother. Oh, they it, hate him. Y'all murderers, because Christ said if you hate your brother, you're a murderer. Yeah. That's what John said. They, they yes, yes. Okay, them. You know, they never killed the old man. They never no. killed the, And they're going to do this. They're going to continue doing this on and off. Yes. They're going to continue. Go ahead, Elvis. Verse, verse 9. Is not the whole land before thee? Mm-hmm. See that we all we all prophets. We trying to doggone teach. The so whole Kansas, land is before us. The so Lord Kansas is, City was just just that one hey, corner. Yeah, that <laughs> one corner. They arguing on one corner. <laughs> right. Hey, they got the whole city. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. exactly. Will they have enough? Oh. <laughs> Real. <laughs> Separate thyself. 
I pray thee from me. See if that? thou will take the left hand, mm -hmm. then I will go to the right. If you teach your doctrine this way, I'm going to teach my doctrine that way. Read. Or if thou depart to the right hand, mm -hmm. then I will go to the left. I'm going to do whatever I got to do to make concessions so that we ain't fighting. Right. He's being the bigger guy. Mm -hmm. That's all it takes is to be the bigger guy. That's the yeah. example of a leader. They all talked. I sat there and saw uh, they had a uh, uh, y'all was up on that the other night trying to show you how to get to success yeah. and success through a good leader. Somebody yeah. teaching people how to climb an obstacle or something like that. But if your leader is a a, a, a maniac, he he's such a proud man that he w doesn't want to lose a fight because he think it's going to make him look smaller. You can't follow a leader like that. He don't have leadership abilities. The right. leader is going to find peace. <clears throat> He's going to mm -hmm. seek a win-win scenario. And if he got to take an L, he counted as the cost of doing business. You know what? Look, bro, let it be like you say. All right? All right, bro, you got us. Okay. Right. we Y'all tougher than us. Y'all real manly men. Go ahead, bro. You can have that thing, man. We're going to go on over here and do something else. Right. And Bring now you, you, what that, 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 that scripture about uh, putting up, um, uh, Heaping hot coals in, heaping hot coals yeah. in your head. Yeah, yeah that's yes. what you're doing. Cause yeah. look, bro, I done went and told you. I'm showing you to be unrighteous. I'm gonna stay above board. I'm not gonna go in the gutter with y'all. Right. right. Let's, let's go ahead, Elder. Hey, see, you let guys don't know this. Yeah, let me touch on two things. Uh, mm -hmm. Isaiah right. 55 and 8. Because they never killed the old man and themselves, and that's yeah. that's. That's the thing. They're gonna, they gonna, they gonna do the Jerry Springer. Yeah. They just, they just ego <laughs> maniacs. All they are. <laughs> They're the new Jerry Springer show. Yeah. yeah. They're just ego maniacs. Both of them. They're huge egos. Oh man. And they think that they got the world up under their thumb. They're gonna find yes. out mm -hmm. something here real quick though. Yeah. Read that. Isaiah fifty five and eight. Yes, sir. But the, for my thoughts are my not... My thoughts, my thoughts, my thoughts, not your thoughts, my thoughts. Read. For my thoughts are not your thoughts. Uh -huh. Neither are your ways my ways, says the Lord. Now let's break this down. It's just a short parable right here. Mm -hmm. Go to uh, Luke chapter 14 and verse 16. It's Christ. He's talking about a parable. We had this in a video before. But you oh, know we, who we're dealing with right here. Okay, Luke chapter 14, He's, verse what? Uh, 14 and 16. Now, he said his ways is different, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. And we're going to jump because I want to shorten the parable. 14 and 16. Luke chapter 14, verse 16. Then said he unto him, A certain man made a great supper and bade many. Now, this man having a supper, great supper, he's teaching. That's the great supper. He's teaching. He's breaking bread. Drop 21. This is those, those count carnal people right here. Because mm. the most high... He's going to write the divide. And I tell you when he, he's going to do it. Luke 21. 14, 21. So that servant came and showed his Lord these things. That's a lowercase Lord. Hey, mm -hmm. Read. That's then, the thing, Read. Then the master of the house, being angry, said to his servant, Go out quickly into the streets and the lanes of the city. Are they doing that? Yes. Mm -hmm. Read on. And bring in hither the poor. The poor in spirit, simple. Read. And main. The ones that don't have any armor on, 
you can persuade them with anything. They don't have the spiritual interpretation. They can right. be easily injured. They don't have the whole arm of God on. Read. And the halt. Read. And the halt is, uh, hold on, the halt is those who don't believe in God. Yes, you, yes. They, they the can't defend means you. Them. Stop. Yeah, they you can't stop defend. believing in God. Yes. yes, you can't defend yourself. Defend right. yourself. Mm -hmm. And the blind. You can't see spiritually. What he's mm -hmm. doing, the manipulation behind the scene, you can't even see it. Read. Right. And, and and then back to that halt. A lot <clears> of the <throat> people who are halt now are people who sat up under those wicked men. And those men turned them against God. Mm -hmm. Literally, yes. because of their doctrine, them people say, I don't want to have nothing to do with God or nothing. Because if God right. sent them men, yes. I don't want to have nothing to do with him. And them the right. people, them them the them the, the ones who that we supposed to be trying to bring into the fold, but those right. men have 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 deceived them people, and now these people don't even believe in God no more because of the example. Yeah. Right. Now that was the lowercase Lord. Read. Right? Mm -hmm. The mm -hmm. Read. Verse twenty-two. And the servant said, "Lord, it is done." No, who thou... said that? That's that's uh uh capital level lower. Mm -hmm. Read. Mm -hmm. It is done. The same thing Christ said, it is done. Read. As thou hast commanded. And there and yet there is room. It's still room. Read. And the Lord Right said, now, he lowercase Lord. And it's the, a lowercase Lord now. You see that? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Read. And the Lord said unto the servant, Go out into the highways and Stop. hedges. <laughs> the highways. The other king you had to call that. Go out mm -hmm. in the highway. Mm -hmm. Take the elevated level. Yep. Come go right back to Isaiah chapter 55 and 8. They don't know how to read the Bible. Isaiah 55 and 8. For well, my thoughts are not your thoughts, neither are my ways. Why are they on the highway? They mm -hmm. literally on the highway. They're not right. taking the highway to elevated level like <laughs> Elder Stephen said. Yes. Mm -hmm. They yes. so simple, man. This man tricking them on the highway. Yes. Right. Fool, get yes. off the street. You don't know the spiritual interpretation. You defiling yourself, son. Right. Uh -huh. Read on. And hedges and compel them to come in. Now, how's the highway and the hedges? The hedges, the hedges, is, the hedges <laughs> is a prophet. Mm -hmm. Yes. They don't even know how to read the Bible. Yes, that's a right. tree. That's a tree. That's a bush. Yes. Right. They don't even know how to read the Bible. Mm -hmm. It's a parable, young man, young lady. The ones who got some sense. Read on. And compel them to come in. Mm -hmm. And that my house may be filled. Now he said yeah. take the highways, right? Yeah. The higher level of yeah. understanding okay. his ways. Read on. For I say unto you that none of those men which were bidden shall taste of my supper. Isn't that true? They don't even understand it. Those are the ones right. that were defied by women. Yes. They oh. out there teaching the same doctrine. <laughs> they, yes. they about to choke each other. Yes. Exactly. You see that? They yes. didn't take the highway. Yes. Now they literally own the highway. Why like, get off the street? Scrap, scrap. <laughs> All right. So let's do a thing about that. So for, let's, let's look at the law. So well, one more, L. One more. I'm sorry. All right. Isaiah 52. I mean, uh, Isaiah 42. Let's prove that point. All right. 42 and 1. Now they literally on the highway. Yes. <laughs> and he talking about something totally different. They, they don't talking know. about taking the elevated level. But see how they lie. Look how they lie though. When they say high place, they know it's talking about a church. Right. They don't know highway talking about the doctrine. You see what I'm saying? They, they lie so quick. Like the man just showed that that uh that uh that uh uh that meme oh, yeah. that he had up now that thumbnail talking about water is the word, right? right? But they got him standing on the water to make you think it's him. 
right. that he Christ. But they ain't right. explaining what the word means. But they know a high place is a church. Right. But they don't know the highway is a doctrine. Hey, they don't my, know that. Hey, Micah like that. I see Micah smile and say, wait a minute. <laughs> the old man over here, boy, step back. Watch out. We're in the first one, you know. Step back. The old man over here, you can't pimp the old man. No, nah, we ain't going to be pimp. Sorry. No, no, no. I ain't no. walking. I ain't hey, walking the street for you. Hey, who was that? Uh, <laughs> Jim Neighbors. Who that? Gomer Fowl. He said, if movement was, shame on you. Movement twice, shame on me. There right. it is. Did Gomer Fowl say that? That's right. That's <laughs> right. Read That's that, right. Elder. <laughs> and I know uh, 90% of y'all don't even know who Gomer Fowl is. That didn't <laughs> Elder just <laughs> oh, man. Man. So Elder dating himself. <laughs> and, uh, I ain't yeah. gonna say I don't know Goma Five, but uh, I just wouldn't. I, I, I wouldn't have brought it up. I see you know Nick, Nick at night, so there we go. I'll back you up, Elder. I see you there Nick at night. I had Nick at night as well. Yeah, at forty-two, Isaiah forty-two and one. You already read that, Elder. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, there you go. Now they right. on the street, right? On the highway. They yeah, literally man. on the highway. Yes. <laughs> son, that ain't yes. what he's saying, son. Right. Your bishop trick you. He's yes. He trick you, boy. Yes. Read that right there. Yes. Isaiah 42 and 1. Behold, my servant. My servant. My servant. My servant. My servant. My <laughs> servant. Read. Whom I uphold. Whom I uphold. Read. Mine elect. He said, hey, this elect. They're not fools. Read. In whom my soul delighteth. Who my soul delight. Read. I have put my spirit upon him. Hello. Read. He shall bring forth judgment to the Gentiles. Read. Hold on, hold on. What's that judgment? What? Okay. <laughs> but go, yeah. Yes. Go right, right. back to it. When, when right you're done. I'm going to so yeah. show what the judgment is. Ecclesiasticus or Sirach in the Apocrypha. A wise judge will instruct yeah. his people. Welcome mm -hmm. to Elders of Israel. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> we work for God. We That's bow right. down to God only. That's right. That's I'm a judgment. servant. That's I a bow down to him only. Yes, oh. that's that's the judgment Read. we doing. I have another precept for judgment too. What you, what you got? Proverbs and, 31 and 9. Well, let's oh. finish this one out. Let's finish okay. this one out. A wise judge will instruct his people, and the government of a prudent man is well ordered. I and haven't let, forgotten. I haven't forgot what Jesus taught us. Right. Right. What was, that, what was the other precept? Proverbs 39 and 9. 31 and 9. Sorry. Uh -oh. Y'all done went and, y'all done went <laughs> no. and got. <laughs> Y'all done went and got the proper test wild up on all right. He said, all look, right. I'll toss a, I'll toss a precept or two at them, too. Yes. <laughs> Why not? Why not? Let you know. Y'all can sit there and think these women on this <laughs> panel don't know what's happening. <laughs> Y'all gonna end up getting humiliated. I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> Sitting up there talking about you a woman, you can't teach. And then uh -huh. they tell you to go up to verse 26 and you're gonna be looking stupid. <laughs> well, men can't teach either in the church. Right. That's <laughs> how so we just be quiet. We both, right. be, quiet. We both be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> Proverbs 31 and 9. Open thy mouth. Judge righteously. Hmm. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. And, and plead the cause of the poor and needy. That sound like teaching to me. That's Thank you, prophetess. Like, Thank, you. Thank you, prophetess. <laughs> right, right on back over here. And right. I'm Judge. sorry, I got another one that I think it will help a bit more. It's First Corinthians 14 and 27 to 29. Yeah, go to that one. Else. All right. <laughs> hey. That's what it's all about. Y'all teach. Yeah. Y'all starting to see. Yes. You know, everybody used to. Uh, verse 27 to 29th. Okay. 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 And then see, y'all starting to see these elders starting to speak a little more. Hmm. <laughs> they used to be real quiet. Mm -hmm. Now they're starting to get a little vocal. Mm -hmm. That's a warning. First Corinthians 14, 27. If any man speak 
in an unknown tongue. <laughs> That's what we just <laughs> let it be by two or at the most by three, and that by course, and let one interpret. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. But if there be no interpreter, let him keep silence. And hey, hey, is, it, is it a woman? Is it a woman too, right? Yeah, that's yes. what it's a man. That. Man you gotta keep quiet in church him. too, bro. Yes. Yeah. It said him. Him. It said him. <laughs> that would say him. H I M me him. Male. Nice. That's him. Him. And let him speak to himself <laughs> and to God. That there means be quiet in the church. Right. Hold case y'all don't foot. know it. Hold right. that foot. <laughs> Let the prophets speak two or three precepts. <laughs> precepts. And let the other judge yes. teach it. That's what's happening right now. That's what you see. Like that. That. Yes. Right. We're going right back yes. to Isaiah 42. Yes. yes. <laughs> Can I bring a Thank precept? Thank you, prophets. Oh, 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 we another you precept. Got one too? Got? Who, who got one? Um, <laughs> okay. I'm John 7, chapter 7, verse 24. John 7, 24. Like I'm oh, going to hit the WCW or something. Uh-oh. <laughs> 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 tight, bro. <laughs> there it is. Yep. Judge chapter 7, verse 24. You know the deep prophet Tessas. You know, you mm-hmm. sit up there and say something about a woman can't <laughs> teach, and they come uh-huh. some correction. <laughs> <laughs> chapter yes, 7, verse 24. Judge not according to appearance, no. but judge righteous. Righteous. Judge. judge. Ain't righteous ain't righteousness a doctrine. Yep. Yeah. Yes. That means yes. teach. Yes. Mm-hmm. Ooh, y'all see that? Yes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so now. Go bring that judgment to the Gentiles. That's right. <laughs> yes. That's right. You see that? You see that yeah. to the Gentiles. So now that you know what judgment is, yes. like when he broke down. Most I said two or three. That was like six, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> That's how we do over here. That's it. Israel. Yes. Right. Now he read that from the top so we keep the thought. We yes. keep the thought back. Isaiah we 42 that. and 1. Behold, Ooh. my servant, whom I uphold, who God upholds. Mine elect. He said, his elect. You can go ahead and say you Israel all you want. He said, my elect. Read. Mm-hmm. In whom my soul delighteth. His soul delight. Mm-hmm. I have put my spirit upon Hello. him. All praise to the most high. He shall bring forth judgment, teaching, Teaching the Gentiles. That's right. Read. (laughs) He shall not cry. Uh -uh. Uh-uh. Nor lift up. Uh Uh-uh. Nor cause his voice (laughs) to be heard (laughs) in the streets. Go out and teach in the highway. (laughs) Not calling it, dumb dog. Surely, uh, uh, yeah, surely, this is an oversight. Cause I think this was the, this is in a black highlighter right here. This the is the backbone <laughs> of their teaching. They go into the streets. Y'all see that? And, and mm-hmm. they took the, hey, they took the low <laughs> weight, and then they about to fight. Yeah, they took the corner weight, yeah, and then they about to fight. Right, right. But notice Man. how much peace we got over here. Oh, yeah, absolutely. We got Lord. plenty of peace over here. Now, every time, some every now and then, somebody will tell me to shut up. And I understand. I talk a lot. Oh, but, you know, home. but we home always home. make up afterward. Let me, let, me my pre- let, me, yes. let me get my precept in for judgment since everybody threw in. We're going to go to the next verse. Yeah, you, you verse, know three. Yeah. verse three. Mm-hmm. A bruised reed shall he not break. Is that right? Mm-hmm. Yes. And the smoking flax shall he not quench. <laughs> he gonna get that doctrine, not uh huh. Oh, he gonna have that fire all the time on you, mm-hmm. boy. He gonna have that fire. Mm-hmm. And he shall bring forth judgment, teaching mm-hmm. unto yes. truth. What's the Jerusalem truth? Jerusalem is the truth. Jerusalem oh, is the truth. Yes, yeah, that's right. That's the, the law. Truth. That's right. The yeah. spiritual right. law. 
Mm-hmm. So yes. these brothers fighting on the street. Yeah. Right? Yep. What was so we just saw between Lot and Abraham the righteous yes. thing to do. So you saw the example. Mm-hmm. So let's go to the law. Yes. Mm-hmm. All right. Let's get the law. All right. So let's get what what God said. All right. Exodus twenty one fourteen. Can you read that? Exodus twenty one and fourteen. But if a man come presumptuously hmm. upon his neighbor and slay him with guile, hmm. thou shalt take him from mine altar that take he him. may. Thou shalt yeah. take him from mine altar that he may die. So what is he talking about? He said, if a man comes to you presumptuously. So mm-hmm. what is he talking about by coming to you presumptuous? Mm-hmm. Let me go to some without cause. We're we'll gonna get it right now. Let's get the let's get a thought going. I'm just trying to get everybody mm-hmm. thought going. <clears throat> mm-hmm. So what is he doing if he comes to you presumptuous? Psalms chapter 19, verse 13. Keep back thy servant also from presumptuous sin. So a presumptuous sin is is not the truth. So it mm-hmm. is a lie. lie. Right? Let them not have dominion over me. Don't let those lies have dominion in your mind. Then shall I be upright. In Jerusalem. Upright. <laughs> <laughs> that word up, man. <laughs> People oh. just they just go right by that word. Oh. Right up oh, to Jerusalem, <laughs> right hand of God is righteousness. <laughs> they look at the most high be talking, man. Just like he said, highway, high, high, way. high doctrine. The right the hand of the Lord right. is righteousness. The right hand is right. The yeah, spiritual like, doctrine. Yeah, right. like like. Like you said, I go up into the upper room. The upper yes. room. <laughs> the, <laughs> the, <laughs> the elevated level, uh, son. Right. <laughs> upper room. Right. The upper room. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and I shall be innocent from the great transgression. That I don't great know what the great lie. transgression is. That's that kind of law. Okay. Mm-hmm. 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 People in transgression. That that uh El, didn't you do a El, uh, a video called yep. the transgressors? Mm-hmm. Yes. 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 I mean, if, if y'all want to go back and watch that video, man, them yes. people lying, man. Them people gonna pay for that. Oh, they gonna pay, bro. Now they He's on the street. <laughs> the same doctor now they fighting. <laughs> fighting over the fighting over the dog on Connor Doc. Hey. And the taxpayer, that's that's the taxpayer's corner. This is they corner. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> it's UPK corner now. Yeah, okay. It's UPK bro. corner now. Okay, bro. What's wrong with y'all, bro? All, All right, right, bro. Okay, bro. All right. All right, bro. All right, so this is what you're supposed to be doing, right? Mm-hmm. So can we read this, please, on? We're still running. along. We're dealing with presumptuous. Read. Do it around him, 17 and 8. Mm hmm. If there arise a matter too hard for thee in judgment, stop. Prophetess just brought this out earlier between the two and three ju- uh, precepts. We're going to, it's breaking it down all over again. He's going to, he's explaining it to you right here. Read. Between blood and blood. is a matter between you two groups, between blood and blood, doctrine and doctrine. Read. Mm-hmm. Plea and plea. Uh huh. Your doctrine and doctrine. All these words be doctrine. Most have sick right. for. <laughs> right. <clears throat> Between stroke and stroke. Yeah. And y'all know y'all sitting out there fighting on the streets. Y'all probably reading this currently like, man, they out there fighting. <laughs> That's what it's saying. Like, but no, we talking about doctrine. Y'all, even if you teach in a doctrine of violence, it's still a doctrine against the most high God. So even no. if you're reading it currently, it's still the same thing. But see, stroke and smoke mean the same thing. Right. See that? Yeah. They don't get that. The most high calling. We always go say, "Hell, hell, what's that? What's that? That uh, precept for smoke, you right. know, for smite." But right. then, uh, you know, yeah. it means the uh, same thing. Did you strike him. One forty one and five. Yes, mm-hmm. one forty one and five. And this mm-hmm. is the uh, the qualifications of a bishop and a deacon, and a deacon, not mm-hmm. a striker. Y'all mm-hmm. see that? Right. Mm-hmm. You got them old false doctrines. See right. that? Boy, uh, get out the street, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Was it out there running in traffic? Being matters of controversy within thy gate. 
Yeah. So somebody comes to you with what? A question. Yes. And it causes a controversy in your camp. Yes. What should you do? Then, yes. then shall thy arise. No, it mean go low. Go Stoop down. Low. <laughs> arise. Do you do Yes. Look at that. <laughs> then shall thou arise. And as a scripture where the most I say, he sent his prophets. Rising Being early. early. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. He said, hey, and Isaiah went at 52. He told him to get up. He said, get up and, and shake the dust off your head. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. That old ran right. over there, boy. Yes, <laughs> exactly. And get mm -hmm. the up. Go into up. Up to Jerusalem. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> into <clears throat> the place. What that's a high that? place. That's a What's high place? place. What's the place, Jerusalem? Jerusalem. <laughs> that's the high place. <laughs> Which the Lord thy God shall choose. He chose mm -hmm. Jerusalem. Right. <laughs> yes. He chose what? the spirit of God. <laughs> mm -hmm. And that, that verse 9, and thou shalt come unto the priests, the mm -hmm. Levites, and yes. unto the judge. Teacher. Teacher. That shall be in those days. In that understanding, because that teacher that's speaking that understanding. So I can't yes. really ask you a question of somebody else's doctrine. I have yes. to go to the person who taught it. Read. Really? And inquire. Ask. Mm -hmm. And they shall show thee the sentence of judgment. So you got to go to the Bible and find the sentence in the Bible on what he's saying and explain it. You have to go to the Bible and find the sentence. Break it down. And 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 again, when, when he's talking about in those days, this is a prophecy, okay? This is a prophecy of now. Right. Okay? He letting you know, because this is a latter days book. All right? Right. He's saying in those days, the people that got the doctrine in your time. Right. The ones that's got that doctrine. He, he gave you three examples of, he said, uh, strokes. He said, uh, it was a couple more he gave. But it all means doctrine. All right. Mm -hmm. He said, you got to go to the priest in your day. The guy that's got that doctrine, that understanding mm -hmm. yeah. in the latter days. All right. Who's the teacher? Mm -hmm. Right. Go ahead. Next verse. <clears throat> verse 10. And thou shalt do according to the sentence judgment, which they of that place Jerusalem. Doctrine, yes, mm -hmm. which the Lord shall choose mm -hmm. the spiritual the Lord, the Lord, doctrine. The Lord chose yes. his prophets, <laughs> yes. the chosen. So the prophet, yeah. the chosen prophets, are the ones going to be able to explain it to you. Yes, yes. Which the place you. which the Lord shall choose shall show thee. So the prophets there are going to show you the, 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 what it means. And thou shalt observe to do according to all that they inform thee. Because they went to the precepts, right? Yes. Now. Yes. Two or three precepts. Verse 11. According to the sentence of the law, which they shall teach thee. Mm -hmm. And according to the judgment, which they shall Tell thee that so the judgment. You what the judgment is again. <laughs> <laughs> thou shalt do. Uh huh. Thou shalt not decline from the sentence. You should not decline from the sentence. If you're not in Jerusalem, now you decline. You went back to where? The earth. earth. Mm -hmm. You went back to carnal. If you we went yeah, from Jerusalem, that's what it means. See? Which they <laughs> shall show thee. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Teach <laughs> to right. the right hand, Stop. nor to the. Y'all see something he wrote? He says, "Go to the right hand." I told you the right mm -hmm. hand earlier is righteousness. Mm -hmm. Righteousness. He said, "Go to the right hand." Me, mm -hmm. nor to the left. Not to the left. <laughs> That's what he's mm -hmm. telling you. Don't go to the left. Mm -hmm. That means you're going carnal. Yes. And the man that will do presumptuously so he's lying mm -hmm. he going to the left right 
and will not hearken unto the priest that standeth to minister there before the Lord thy God. Mm-hmm. That's talking about us. Yes, mm-hmm. the spirit Because we use in his doctrine. So we chose his that? ways. We yes. chose mm-hmm. his ways, the spiritual way. Or unto the judge, teacher, mm-hmm. even that man shall die. Convert. Mm-hmm. And thou shalt put away the evil from Israel. So that yes. evil was that lie that he told that doctrine he brought him. So now when we go back, so now you guys get an understanding now. Here we go back to Exodus 21. I know it seems long, but you really got to get the full understanding. So we're going to walk it through. So Exodus 21, 14 again. Exodus 21, 14. <clears throat> but if a man come presumptuously unto his neighbor, mm-hmm. lying. So, yeah. So when we read, I'm going to break it down. And slay him with guile, mm-hmm. thou shalt take him from mine altar that he may die. So what is <clears throat> this, this parable is saying? If a man comes and lies to his brother, so his neighbor is not of his house. So that means somebody who does not have his belief system. That's why he's his neighbor. Mm-hmm. So if you came to this guy and lied to him, right, mm-hmm. and slay him with guy, you, sl- you, you converted him with a lie. Mm-hmm. And then right. they'll take him from mine altar. So you took him from the Lord, yes. the Lord that he may convert. That's what he's saying. Yes. Mm-hmm. Next verse. <clears throat> and he that smiteth, there it go, his mm-hmm. father or his mother shall be surely put to death. Who's your father supposed to be? He is the father. The God's the father. So that, so he that yeah, smited him. So he's saying, this parable is saying, if you teach that doctrine, you smited his father. So now you're teaching his doctrine and his law. You shall surely convert. That's what he's telling you. I hope you guys see that. He yeah. that smited his father. His so the, father. the father of the guy who taught you lies. Mm-hmm. So if you look at this, if a man came to you presumptuously, so he came to you with a lie and he, he converted you. So now this right here, you started verse 15. You started teaching that lie. Because the father yes. is, is the father is him, and his mother is his law. Yes. He shall surely be put to death. Because now he just took you away from God. So yes. now you yes. converted yes. to that guy's lie. Yes. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Verse sixteen. Mm-hmm. Verse sixteen. And he that stealeth a man. So what did you stole a man from? Who? Who did you steal him from? God. That's what he's talking about. You stole him from God. Read. God. And sell it him. That doctrine that he, that presumptuous doctrine, that guile doctrine that you had in the preceding vor, uh, verse, you 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 bought, you sold him that doctrine, or he converted him with that doctrine. He starts to believe it, or he be found in his hand. So he's found in your doctrine. He you found in oh, his oh, doctrine. Who, who he got caught you up for hand? Yes, I do. Here we go. Give me a second. Give me a second. <laughs> <laughs> now, she ain't okay, the only I one have, can chime legend. in. All y'all can I, chime in. I have Exodus 40 and 31. There you go. Let's go right there. We go right there. Listen, y'all gonna understand. Because they've been teaching that same uh scripture that we just read about somebody being caught in his hand. They say that, yeah, the white man went and took and put black people into slavery. Mm-hmm. And whenever, when them UFOs come, if they be found uh, in, in that white man's hand, when them UFOs come, the, 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 the driver, the pilot of the UFO going to make sure that them white folks all get killed <laughs> or something like that. It ain't, it ain't verbatim, but it go along them lines. <laughs> it's a lie. The thing yes. means something different. Yes. Okay? Yes. Mm-hmm. Yes. It's Lift that up a little story. bit, Elder. All right, Exodus chapter 40, verse 30. And he set the labor between the tent of the congregation and the altar and put water there to wash with all. We just saw what the water was earlier, correct? Water yes. is the word, yeah. right? So Deacon, Asap. Deacon Asap taught us that. But right. go ahead. Next <laughs> verse. <laughs> 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 and Moses and Aaron and his son washed their hands and their feet <laughs> thereat. 
So they clean their doctrines. Doctrines and their followers. And their followers. And their followers. Yeah. Let me yes. get another. Let me get another one. Who got another one? I, got, I have. Yeah. Oh, sorry, yeah. I have another one that just supports the righteousness. What you all there just said about the right hand, and is uh, uh, is uh, yeah, that, size forty-one and ten. That's where I was going. All right. <laughs> yeah. In the spirit. Yeah. With our precepts combined. Yes. <laughs> and you got one too, Elder Tobiah. I have one as well. Oh. Okay. Yes. Yeah, Oh, hold on, sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah, we 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 gonna get them all because we yep. want to let these people know. <laughs> we want to let them know. Yeah, we ain't boy. playing no games around. Because <laughs> right? no right? whenever they come to the street, y'all gonna be sitting there. Y'all gonna be looking. You go first thing gonna come to your mind is uh oh. That's what's gonna come to your mind. Yeah. Yeah. Isaiah forty one and ten. Fear mm -hmm. thou not, for I am with thee. Be not dismayed, for I am thy God. I will strengthen thee, yea, I will help thee, yea, I will uphold thee with the right hand of <laughs> righteousness. He just called hand righteousness. Is that is righteousness a doctrine? Mm, he yes. said right hand. Remember I said right. earlier, that's backed up the right hand. <laughs> yes, right. <laughs> Absolutely. What you got, so, Elder Tobiah? What you got, boy? Oh, up Psalm 54. Psalm 54 and what? Four. All right. All right. Psalm yeah, we got plenty of time. I've got oh, nothing. Yeah, to we, do. yeah. Come on. Y'all can follow my dick. We all going to get them in. Right. <laughs> Psalm 54 and 4. Is that what you wanted? That's what you want. Elder Tobias. Okay. What, which one you want? Psalm 54 and 4? Is that what you yeah. said? Yes. Okay. Let, let me check. Is that what you want? Could it be 45 and 4? Mm. Yes. Is what a 45 and 4? Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, yes. Yeah, okay. Yes. Yes. It happens. Yeah. Psalms 45 and 4. And in thy majesty, ride pro prosperously because of truth and meekness and righteousness. And thy right hand shall teach <laughs> terrible things. Mm -hmm. Did it just say the right hand going to teach? Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> Look out. Uh -oh. Wait, wait, yeah, Contessa. I have one. Um, Psalms 118, verse 16. 118, 16. This <laughs> is how two or three precepts come together. Mm -hmm. Y'all see that? Yeah. <laughs> but they burn with fire today. Right, yeah. two, or three, two or three bring the precepts, the other That's one right. teach. <laughs> That's right. Psalms 118, 16. The right hand of the Lord is mm -hmm. exalted. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the right hand of the Lord doeth do it valiantly. Y'all see that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right that that, that but, thing is it's above. Exalted mean above. Mm -hmm. they learn it. Yes. Yes. Boy, yes. they learn it fast. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. No. Yes. Oh, you right. said you had one elder elder Sam. Yeah, about the way I got plenty of, but I yeah, give me one, give me one, give me one. Habakkuk two and fifteen. I'm telling you, I don't want I don't want them to think these young upstarts about the about to overshadow you, though. <laughs> oh, I got plenty. Hey, I want them to do their thing. Yeah. 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 He got drowned out. He <laughs> got drowned out. What? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> That's what they bring. <laughs> Bringing precepts everywhere, yeah. man. Precepts started I'm falling out of the sky. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Back of 215. Woe unto him that gives his neighbor drink. That's what they did, then. Mm -hmm. That and same carnal dead doctor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And put his that bottle to him. See that? And make makes him drunk and also. Are they drunk? Yes. Mm -hmm. I mean, they staggered all over the place. Blind, drop, naked. <laughs> I see it all spiritually. 
Mm-hmm. Thou, that thou mayest look upon their nakedness. See that? That shame, that sin. See? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We see it. We see it. Go to uh, Deuteronomy 13 and 6. Oh, I thought you had one for hand. Right. Oh, no, no, no. I was, I was backing up what else. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> now, now, we, now, we, we had a note with that hand. I mean, yeah. good God, yeah. y'all don't slap them all kind of way with that hand. He's just done. He's just done, man. I don't slap them with that hand. I think they got the picture with that hand. Yes. Well, let me finish this up. Will we go yeah. back to Exodus? Finish our Exodus? Exodus 21, 16. I'm sorry, Elder. I know you was going to uh, Deuteronomy no. 13. No, you go ahead. Okay. No, go ahead, Elf. Go ahead. Exodus 21, 16. And he that stealeth a man and selleth him. Mm-hmm. Or if he be found in his hand. And that person who lied to you presumptuously's doctrine. He shall surely be put to death. He shall surely convert to that lying doctrine. Mm-hmm. Y'all see that? They ain't talking about the white man putting black people in slavery. Yeah, I sold that man. They, he sold they, you. Were saying, they use this. Yes. yes. It's one of yes. the strongholds. That's what right. they teach. That's what they because teach in order to make right. you hate your brother. You yes. They start yeah. teaching it that about they, they bring it back to slavery. And we didn't prove yeah. that the Israelites yeah. put white folks in slavery. Yes. On the, right. them Barbary yes. Pirates. So mm-hmm. that, 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 that dog won't hunt. Everybody been a slave. Everybody yeah. been a slave. You check history, all of us been slaves. White folk, mm-hmm. black folk, Chinese folk. Japanese mm-hmm. folk, everybody been slaves. I mean, yeah. we just up to date, current, up to, what, 600 years ago, black folks was enslaved. Nah, mm-hmm. but there's some white folks enslaved, Indians, Native Americans enslaved, everybody been slaved. Anytime mm-hmm. you can't kill that old man, that's where God said, I'm going to send your enemy against you. Because yes. you should have killed the enemy in you and right. taught mm-hmm. them how to slay that enemy in them. Yes. Mm-hmm. yes. See that? Verse, verse 17. And he that curses his father or his mother shall surely be put to death. He that curseth mm-hmm. his father and mother. With cursing guy... words, they were. Right. Mm-hmm. Curseth. Mm-hmm. Okay, also, didn't God curse the ground? Yes, he did. He sure did. Didn't he give the Israelites a curse? He sure did. And they mm-hmm. said they know gods their fathers did not know of. Yeah, you start serving yes. gods and their father. Mm-hmm. So yes. guess what? You cursed your father because you're following a different doctrine. So who's yes. your father supposed to be? God. God. Oh, no. mm-hmm. He that cursed his father. So he that cursed God mm-hmm. or God's law mm-hmm. shall what? Shall surely be put to death. Be put to death. Meaning what? Meaning what? Convert. Because you curse God, so you turn your back on God. So you convert right. it to a different doctrine. That's what it's telling you. That same presumptuous lie that he told you in the preceding verse. Now, this is currently what happened out there with ISUPK and I, I, IUIC. Read. And if men strive together mm-hmm. and one smite another with a stone mm-hmm. or with his fist mm-hmm. and he die not but keepeth his bed so, is this talk about dudes fighting? No, no. Let's get no, 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 no. it. Let's no. get it out of Jerusalem. If men yes. are striving together, guys are in an argument. We just read it earlier. I go, that's why we brought it earlier about that um, the law when two men are coming together and they had to hit them with stones to bring it to the Levites. The Levites yes. show you the sentence. Mm-hmm. If men strive together and one smite another with a stone, what's a stone? A stone is a law. law. That's it. Who so got now, a precept? Yes, uh, we got a precept of song. Uh, Acts, one Acts and Peter. What about, yes, 3118. Yeah, yeah, what? Acts what? He said Acts Exodus 3118. Yes. Oh, we need it right yeah. now. No, it's, it's one in uh, Peter's too. Right, Exodus 3118. Yes. One of the best ones in Peter. <laughs> mm-hmm. right. Y'all find yes. it. Why y'all find that? We pulling up scriptures. I have I have the, what, the one in Peter. Okay. Yeah, right. yeah, I'm All right, holding cool. it. All right, let's roll. <laughs> They ready to go. They excited now. Everybody eating meat now. Let me at him. <laughs> Exodus. Exodus, Exodus 31 18. And he gave unto Moses when he had made an end of communing with him 
upon Mount Sinai, who tables of testimony. Mm-hmm. What that mean? <laughs> what two tables? tables of testimony? The table of words. The, 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 the words of the laws. What kind of words? The, yeah, the, the God of God and the Spirit. Yes. yes. Man, 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 you, brother, man. brother, that, that, that old man got it. I, <laughs> I mean, that old man got it. He, he got it. Elder Dubai playing no, the game. Elder, Elder Dubai. I'm saying you're old because I'm old too, Elder Dubai. No, <laughs> 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 so I'm saying you got it, brother. You got the light. Well, he got that light. Yeah. He the shine, ain't it? Yes, sir. Right. See, he said, "He said, let your light shine because your light is God's light. Yeah, they right. think it's so they shine because they corner light. Yeah, Are man. you sick? You want the light of God to shine in you? That your light. Yeah, yeah. I'll right. praise it uh, to the Most High, Elder. Right. Okay. Two tables of testimony, tables of stone written mm-hmm. with the finger. That's a member yeah. of mm-hmm. God." <laughs> I, 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 last time I checked, a finger was part of your hand. Yeah, yes, right. And we just we just showed you what the hand was. So oh, now we show this finger is part of the hand. So it's the same yeah, thing, baby. Same so now who, who said who they the had one? that, Peter? You I do. At first Peter two and four and five. Yeah, you go. There you go. <laughs> y'all just don't know how. How y'all making me feel, boy? Well, you know, <laughs> you, you just don't know how it's making them people watch for you who sitting up there. <laughs> Saying, oh my God, we gotta go up against all of them. I thought right. it was just three. <laughs> no, brother. We the Hollywood squares over right. here. Right. <laughs> all the squares filled in. <laughs> right. First Peter two and four. Mm-hmm. To whom coming as unto a living stone. Mm-hmm. This allowed indeed of men but chosen of God and precious, ye also as lively stones Mm. are built up a spiritual house. No, a corner house. Spiritual (laughs) house. No, 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 a corner house, a corner house. Spiritual house. Okay, okay, I give in. Spiritual. All right. <laughs> <laughs> and holy priesthood. No, mm. not holy. No, no, not holy. And holy priesthood. Okay, I give up. <laughs> to offer <laughs> spiritual sacrifice. No, 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 no you no. read it wrong, Elder. Man, you gotta, you gotta sacrifice some animals. <laughs> animal sacrifice. No. Get a kill. <laughs> <laughs> we, we ain't barbecuing? That's right. <laughs> spiritual sa- sacrifice is acceptable to God by mm-hmm. Jesus Christ. So yeah. there is your stone. So when we come back, that yes. he says, yes. you read that, Elder. <clears throat> And if men strive together mm-hmm. and one smite another with a stone. So he came with the precept, right? So he came to you and he tried to convert you with a precept, right? Read. Or his fist. This is part of your hand. Doctrine. Or his doctrine, right. He came with his precept or his doctrine. And he died not. And you didn't convert. You did not convert. But keepeth his bed was he a kept bed. His, yeah. <laughs> was a bed. This is doctrine. Right. So he kept yeah. his doctrine. Yes, yes. He laid down in that bed. Yep. Yes. Yep. Mm-hmm. If he rise again. It, what does that mean? <laughs> right. Go up to Jerusalem. He yeah. goes back yeah. up to Jerusalem. Yeah. So this, remember, it said if men strive together. So that means these two men are in an argument. Mm-hmm. That's what mm-hmm. you got to remember. So right. if he rise again, he right. went to Jerusalem. Right. And so what did he do? He got another precept. Yes. yes. He got two of them. Yes. <laughs> and get and on. walk abroad upon his staff. Remember, Elder said, my ways are not your ways. He brought that out earlier. So right. he's walking on that staff. Staff is wood. Yes. Mm-hmm. That's that rod. That's that rod. Remember what so, it, when, Soft two and nine. Mm-hmm. That's what Aaron laid down. So yes. now he be- you were in your doctrine. So you got your doctrine. You walking abroad upon your staff, that means you got your doctrine. Then shall he that smote him be quit. He gonna shut up. 
Yes. Shut because you don't got because you don't got another precept to correct him. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> he ain't got no answer. Psalms one forty one and five. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's what y'all doing with them precepts. Oh my God, with that hand, but y'all slapped them both. <laughs> yes. <Yeah. laughs> That's right. Right. Oh my only, God. Only he shall pay for his loss. Of his time, yeah, that doctrine that he taught. <laughs> yes, he gonna pay. He yes. meaning, meaning he gonna buy that man doctrine. He gonna convert. He gonna convert. He gonna convert. Right. Y'all yeah, see yeah, that? Yeah. And <laughs> shall mm-hmm. cause him to be thoroughly healed. You gonna heal that doctrine? Yes. yes. Y'all see that? Mm-hmm. Man, look how yeah. you, look how this thing changing, man. Everybody sitting yes. up in that time, like, man. If you whoop your you whoop your your brother behind and all this other stuff, Yo. you are gonna have to pay him this this that. No, oh, they ain't my. talking about that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> they ain't talking about that. Verse twenty. <laughs> and if a man smite his servant, hold on. If a man smite God's servant, you got to see yeah. how God is writing. It. So he's talking about his servant, right? Yeah. Or a maid. Or God's doctrine. With a rod. With your own doctrine, your own way. Yes. Yes. And he died under his hand. Break that down, Tobias. I know what you mean. Break it down. Break it down. What do you mean he said he died under his hand? What does that mean? He died under his hand. He was converted. You converted that brother, yes. (laughs) He shall surely be punished. Because you converted that man Brother away Jeremy. from God. God. Yes. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Notwithstanding, if he continue a day or two, he shall not be punished. For he is his money. For he is his money. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So money, he is his money. So his money is his follower. Yes. yes. You guys so, see what money yes. is? Yes. yes. That's good Hold on. Yeah. We're not going before we go there because I'm going before you get there and kill it. Mm-hmm. Now, why did he say notwithstanding if he continue a day or two? What is he talking about? Anybody have any clue? It's okay if you don't have it. All right. So now we're going to go to Genesis one. Why he mm-hmm. said do it for a day or two? Oh, what day? oh yeah. What day what are you is on? It? What is it? What go, go ahead, Deanna. No, 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 no. I do, but I, I have like um, it's uh, it is understanding, but it's what you do on the first day. Yes, on the days. Okay, let's yeah. deal. Let's deal. He said two or more days. So what yeah. day were you on? You got to see what day were you on when you got the understanding. So let's go right. to Genesis one seventeen. Can you read that? Yes. <laughs> Genesis chapter one verse seventeen. Mm-hmm. And God sent them in the firmament mm-hmm. of the heaven to give light upon the earth. Light upon the earth. Okay, let's get what he's talking about. I'm just doing that because of that precept's going to be at the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> Psalms, <laughs> Psalms 47 and 7. For God is the king of all the earth. Sing ye praises with understanding. So we're showing you right there that's it's understanding. So let me get the one I was looking for. It was a chapter over. I'm sorry, you guys. It's 85 and 11. Well, 84 and 11. All right. So now back on the thought what the earth is. Did you read Psalms 85 11. Truth shall spring out of the earth. What shall come out the earth? Truth. Shall so spring truth. out of the earth. So the law shall spring out of the earth. Uh huh. And righteousness shall look down from heaven. So that's above. Heaven is above, right? So that's yes. Jerusalem. Right. So truth yes. shall come out the earth. So here, if it's truth, it shall come out the earth, and the earth is truth. Why do we call it carnal? Anybody understand why we call it carnal? Because the earth was cursed. Because it's in, in the earth. 3. Yeah. Yes, it was cursed in mm. Genesis 3. So now. Go back to Genesis 1, 17. Read. Genesis 1, 17. And God set them in the firmament of the heaven and gave light upon the earth. So now he just said that the truth shall come out of the earth. Remember we just read that? So now. Read. 
and to rule over the day and over the night. What's the day? Understanding. And what's the night? Ignorance. ignorance. Okay, so the rule over the understanding and the ignorance. Read. And to divide the light, mm-hmm. wisdom, from the dark. From the ignorance. Ignorance again. Ignorance. And God saw that it was good. I want you to read that again, <clears throat> Elder. And I need you to read right after the comma, right here after night. And to divide the light from the darkness. Okay, so that is what day? One day. And the evening and the morning were the fourth day. So what I'm trying to show to you, those who can rightfully divide, you're on the fourth day of the Lord's understanding. That's why when you go back to that scripture, he said that you will have um, two or more days in Mm -hmm. Exodus. Yes, he said you you, you tarry on for two or more days. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's sad that they don't know don't know how to read the Bible, man. And right. they, and you know they're forcing people. Yeah, that's it. Twenty one. Not to learn how to read. The so Bible. when it tells you here, notwithstanding, if he continue a day or two more, mm-hmm. he should not be punished for he is money. Why would he not be punished by the Lord? Because you're starting to do what by the fourth day? Understand. You got to understand. Divide what? Yes, yeah, you start to divide the word. Yes, you start to divide the word. From this. The, you start to divide spiritual. the carnal from the spiritual on the fourth day. That's what the, yes. the fourth day. So let's look at the fifth day. Yeah, 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 That's yeah, when it's yeah. grace kicking in. See, yes. grace, the most high give you grace. He's teaching you by mm-hmm. weight. He teaches so you now, by weight. Mm-hmm. Verse 22. So what happens on the, on, the, on the fifth day? You read that, Elder? Verse 22. And God blessed them, saying, Be fruitful and multiply and fill the waters in the sea and let fire multiply in the earth. Mm-hmm. But well, before you go. That's heavy right there. Now, well, so, now so, 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 go ahead, go ahead. Now, look how it's saying, be fruitful Teach. and multiply. Be, you know this you, how, <laughs> yeah. uh, now, now, you know Because you got the understanding now. You're, starting, yeah. you, you're on that level of understanding. You can mm-hmm. teach, they say, be fruitful. Plant the mm-hmm. seed. Now, 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 check this out. Up until now, I've had very several occasions where I get up in here and I say, somebody give me a pre-sale, right? And, you know, it'd be a little, you know, cricket, cricket, cricket. You know, one guy <laughs> chime in, but you don't hear nothing else. You know what I'm saying? Check out how all these pre are flowing right now. Mm-hmm. So when uh, you go back you know, and read it again, y'all see what it's talking about. He's talking about what yes. y'all at. Y'all see y'all, it? Right? Yes. That's what it's I'm y'all. to y'all. What they yes. are. And I, <laughs> yes. I'm going to bring up something after this, too. I'm going to bring up something after this so y'all will know the most high is here teaching. Yeah. Is we just vessel. We just right. vessel. And that's we why, know this. That's the why he said he is teaching. Yes, sir. That's why he it's, said it's, he's it's, Yes, it's a way you have to teach. Money. He said, no jot, no tittle. Mm-hmm. And you see how fast y'all learning, how y'all progressing in the spiritual yes. terminology now. It's a yes. certain way you have to teach to get this understanding of what Elder King you had to bring it out. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yes. We've been protecting this doctrine like Yes. Yeah, and we'll have a, just three minutes and I'm going to show you because okay. all of y'all right here, what he's talking about right here. And God, so, and God so. bless them, saying, "Be fruitful and multiply, and fill the waters in the sea, and let fire multiply on the earth." And the evening and the morning were the fifth day. So, what does somebody with the fifth day of understanding can do? Teach. Does anybody know? Teach. Yes. So the fourth day you can rightfully divide. So when mm-hmm. you read the Bible, you're starting to find, okay, that word ain't that, that ain't word. You're starting to split mm-hmm. it down. Yes. This ain't this. You starting the fifth day, you can now teach the understanding to somebody. Yeah, That's why that. God said if you mm-hmm. go a day or two more, he's money. Because what mm-hmm. would somebody do with that money? What, what is why is he money? Think about that. Because why he has the understanding. But why is he money? Why is he money to why is he money to a liar? 
Think about this. Why is he money to a liar? Think about but it real he, hard. He can guess he can he can't compete with the spiritual understanding. Right. But if I was a liar and mm -hmm. I'm I'm a preacher and I'm lying and I call mm -hmm. you my money, what are you doing? Oh, to correct. Uh, you see what I'm saying? You're teaching for yeah. me. So guess what you're doing? Him. You're bringing people. Remember what Labaka said? Yeah, he's it's bringing nine dollar hit. Yeah. You're bringing them back to me. Now they're you my know. money. Yes, yes. It's money yeah. now. Let yeah. me ask. Because you, yeah. Yeah. Yes. Because yes. now you went two more days. Now you can teach. Now mm -hmm. you got the understanding to teach. That's why these brothers go to men of valor. They go mm -hmm. through all that stuff so they can get the fifth day. Mm -hmm. Now it's yeah. money to yeah. that, that person that's speaking presumptuously because yeah. now yeah. he teaching for them to bring in more. Money, remember we just yes. said that earlier about money. He's money yes. to him yes. because yes. you're bringing him yes. in. Yes, y'all, yes. y'all get what Elder yes. King you understand. It's the same thing when, um, when Judas betrayed Christ. Yes, it, it was a, it was thirty pieces of silver. Those was a congregation. Right. Yes, he took that back, and that man said, "We cannot put that them back in our treasury." Right. And that will mess up the rest of the congregation. Correct. The people been been taught by Judas, and Judas was been taught by Christ. Right. That's he the reason why they when they understand that he was teaching yes. against they doctrine. Mm -hmm. That's why Nathaniel turned everybody against that person once they leave, because mm -hmm. he know for a fact when that person leave, that person been taken out of Egypt. Right. Yes. You see that? Mm -hmm. You can't use them no more. You can't use them no more. Y'all gonna be smarter. And this right. Christ said that. He said, I got to get you out of the city for me to yes. teach you. Yes. And that's what Christ would do. He would pull them out of them congregations. You call them graveyards. He was right. pulling them out. Y'all yeah. see it. Y'all see it. All praise. So, so we're getting with these days. When he's talking about, so by the sixth day and the seventh day, you got complete understanding of the doctrine. You get what I'm saying? So I'm just giving you an uh, abbreviated version of that when he's saying right here in Exodus 21, notwithstanding, if he continue for a day or, or two, so you went to the fourth day. So now you're right for the divide. So now if you add two more days to that fourth day, what you got? Sixth day. You see what I'm saying? You see what your level of, mm -hmm. you got to that sixth day of understanding. Mm -hmm. Now you're money to the, now you money. You get what I'm saying? Now he, oh, you're God. God's money. You see what I'm right. saying? Because now you have total understanding. Right. You're about to be gold. You yes. about to be gold. Your currency. So yeah. God looks at the people as currency. So yes. anybody who teaching a different doctrine is either money for that king or that uh, prophet, mm -hmm. or your yeah. money for God. Yeah, right. yeah, 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 what side yeah, yeah, are you yeah, yeah. on? Remember, we just read. We just uh, we read before in um, Acts eight uh, about that eunuch who um, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. who uh, uh, Philip taught. Yes, and. It said that he was a uh, he was a, a eunuch. He but he he was a he was a, a of a high level in mm -hmm. that other yeah. doctrine. So he what he's saying is you are gonna either be a currency for whoever your father is that taught you your doctrine, mm -hmm. or you are gonna be a currency for the Most High, who is the true Father, and that the person who taught you was a son of God. You see what I'm saying? You don't went. You don't learn God's doctrine versus another man, mankind's doctrine. doctrine. Right? Y'all yeah, yeah, see yeah, that yeah. he making a distinction mm -hmm. between the two. The sixth yes. day on some other doctrine, the Most High don't care nothing about that. He care about uh, whenever you learning his doctrine. Them other yes, people, doctrine. he ain't he 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 not accepting that. What you say, uh, Romans eight? Let you know the Most High. He don't he don't deal with that kind of foolishness. That's period. Awesome. So let's let's get an example. I have an example for it of, of, of what we're talking about. Mm -hmm. yes, okay. So this is Joe Ash and J, J, uh, Yoahida. They were cleaning up the church, right? Because mm -hmm. they had all those wicked doctors in there. So this is what he said to him. Second Kings 12 and 4. Mm -hmm. And Jehoash said to the priests, all the money of the dedicated things that is brought into the house of the Lord, even the money of everyone that passes the account. Every one. Mm -hmm. The money of everyone that passes the account. Mm -hmm. The money that every man is set at 
his level of understanding mm-hmm. is his money. Re and all the money that cometh into any man's heart. Matthew 15, 19, heart is the mm-hmm. mind. To bring into the house of the Lord. Ooh. So what is he talking about? He's talking about prophets. So we're going to drop down to verse 9. They're buying and selling prophets. Mm-hmm. So this is, what, this is what he did to correct the doctrine. But Jehoiada, the priest, took a chest and bore a hole in the lid of it and set it beside the altar mm-hmm. on the right side. What side? We just went over what side. The right side is righteousness, correct? Right. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. As one cometh into the house mm-hmm. of the Lord. And the priest that kept the door put therein all the money that was brought into the house of the Lord. We're talking about all those doctrines that came in. So they're about to correct all those doctrines that came into the house of the Lord. And it was so. When they saw that there was much money in the chest... Stop. So this is what was happening. Imagine, remember last week when we brought the video about them stealing? Mm-hmm. This is kind of the same thing going on right here. They're taking doctrines. Mm-hmm. So they saw that the doctrine was 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 much more. It was it was it was a nice doctrine, right? Read mm-hmm. that the king scribe and the high priest came up, mm-hmm. and they put up in bags. Put up in bags. So they started making preset packets and told the money that was found in the house of the Lord. So they told the money. So they started teaching the lessons. That's the money. That's why God said he is money. They started being teachers. Ready? And they gave the money being told. Being what? Told. told. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> Into the hands of them. Doctor. That that did mm-hmm. the work uh, that, mm-hmm. that had the oversight of the house of the Lord. So they had total understanding of God's word. Read. And they laid it out to carpenters, prophets, and, and builders of the house of the Lord that wrought upon the house of the Lord. So the I Lord. hope you guys, you start yeah. to see what the, what the money yeah. is yeah. right then in this situation. So now, Let's go to try to move this quickly because I know we had a uh, Leviticus twenty one. When they say carpenters is building the house and stuff, mm-hmm. oh the Lord, that's what. Yeah, they, yeah. Remember so, that's you know, the they said Christ. They said hey, that's carpenter's son. Yes. Um, they also said Paul was a tent maker, building mm-hmm. the house of the Lord. Yeah. Yeah. It's saying Keep. it's a prophet. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a prophet. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Leviticus 22 and 7. And when the sun is down. With the sun. Sun's a, wisdom, wisdom, there we go. Wisdom, 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 wisdom. Right. It's down. It's meaning it went down, right? There's no understanding. Yeah. Right. After, so he got understanding. So when the sun is down. So for the sun to go down, it had to rise. You get what I'm saying? So he got understanding. So now it's back down. So now he, he got he, it. He, he, he got ready it for the next lesson. Yes, right. listen. Right. He, he cleaned that. Right. Yes. Right. Back to even. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. When the sun is down, he shall be clean. Mm-hmm. Meaning he got the word. He got. Yeah. He got. The, he sanctified yeah. now with the word, the washing mm-hmm. of the word. Mm-hmm. And shall afterward eat of the holy things, because it is his food. That is. That's the precept for food as well. Right. Mm-hmm. Yes. yes. Yeah. He gonna eat. He gonna eat holy things because now he has switched over. Yeah, he converted to to the spiritual right. now. Mm-hmm. Elder, do you need the precept for food? No, nah, we we'll keep going. I'm trying to okay. uh, move past. Thank you, though. Appreciate it. Leviticus twenty-two, verse eight: mm-hmm. That which dieth of itself, 
or is torn with beast. So if you die yourself, you start believing in your own, own hype. Right. Yeah. 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 never broke that down on the video. <laughs> right. If you die yourself, you believe in your own hype, bro. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. You know, God words never dies. He said that right. your word don't die. Mm -hmm. God use my word. God say my I way will yes. never die. Yes. Or is torn with beasts. Was mm -hmm. beast. Was beast. Uh, Carnal man. Yes. 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 He e shall go ahead out. E class is what? Three eighteen. Okay. <laughs> he shall not eat to defile himself therewith. Not mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we'll drop down to verse eleven. So we got what he what we're basically talking about in this law, right? So now for mm -hmm. time constraint, we're gonna go down to verse eleven. Verse 11, but if the priest buy any soul with his money, his doctrine, he shall eat of it and mm -hmm. shall it. learn of it. Mm -hmm. And he that is born in his house came under his doctrine, mm -hmm. they shall eat his meat. So the meat eat his understanding. So it shows you what the money is. Okay, so for time's constraints, we went there for money. Let's get one more for the money. One more for the money. Two for the show. <laughs> One for the money. Two One for the, the show. Stupid three to show. get ready. Four to go. That's old school. Uh, right. You know, I got one for money I'll after be. you, Elder. Okay. okay. All right. So I know we see this a lot. So now let's break this down. So now you're going to have new eyes when you look at the scripture. Yes. Mm -hmm. Wisdom is good with an inheritance. Mm hmm. <laughs> and by it, there is profit to them that see the sun. Isn't profit money? Yep. You gaining yeah. something? Is you mm -hmm. gaining something? The profit is you gaining something that see the right. sun, that see the understanding. So let's see what it's saying next verse. For well, wisdom is a defense. Wisdom is a defense. And money is a defense. Then we just run through like three or four precepts to show that money is a doctrine. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. So that your doctrine is a defense. Right. Read. But the excellency of knowledge is mm -hmm. that wisdom giveth life to them that have it. That is what the money is. So I know we see this all the time, but that's what he's talking about. Okay. Anybody yes. got anything else before we move on? Who got the money? I got one elder. No. Uh, -huh. oh, uh Genesis 47 and 15. Genesis 47, 15. And when money failed in Egypt, I like this one, brother. I like that one right there. Yeah, yeah man. Well, I tell y'all awesome, boy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the land of Canaan, <laughs> all the Egyptians came to Joseph <laughs> mm -hmm. and said, and said, give us bread. <laughs> give us understanding, Sirach 15, 1 through 3. <laughs> yes. For why should we die in thy present? For the money, <laughs> for the money faileth. <laughs> that doctrine is horrible, man. I ain't got no understanding. It ain't no good, man. <laughs> Most ain't I got no understanding, bro. <laughs> and Joseph said, give me your cow. Give your cow. <laughs> the people following you mm -hmm. and I will give you for your cattle if money fail <laughs> <laughs> okay. that's a good one that's a good right, one right, yes right. And, yes very strong right and they so, brought, oh you okay alright so now we got what money is so now mm -hmm. let's think about titles here right let's think about so a person that deals with money is called a what a merchant in the Bible yeah. it sells you anything right, right? Yes. So let's go with a famous merchant. Since we see here in Genesis, all praises to the prophet to bring it out. Mm -hmm. We'll go right on over to 23 and 12, uh, Genesis 23 and 12. Let's get a, well, Abraham. Mm -hmm. All right. When he had, uh, yeah. Genesis 23, 12. 
And Abraham bowed down himself before the people of the land. So he teaching the people of his land, right? He had to teach them at the level where he at. So he went carnal? No, nah, he just no, like, no, he no. went. No, no. You know how we explain, we'll say, we'll, we'll break it down. We'll give it two ways. That's what he's giving. So he has okay. to come down, meaning I have to give it to the level where okay. you at. Because if I'm okay. speaking bread, and I'm saying, yeah, <laughs> we got bread, we eat every day. We know I'm speaking bread to you. You know being the word. Somebody else looking on the side like, what are you talking about, bread? So I have to say, bread means this. Here's the scripture. That's what he's doing. Okay. All right. And he spake unto Ephraim in the audience of the people of the land, mm -hmm. saying, But if thou wilt give it, I pray thee, hear me, I will give thee money for the field. For well, that congregation. So he's giving you a mm -hmm. doctrine. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Take it of me, <laughs> and I will bury my dead there. Those who didn't understand, that's the dead, right? Mm -hmm. he's giving, so he's teaching. This is all of audience. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he, he, that, that sepulcher that he bought to bury Sarah in, that's a church. Y'all know that, mm -hmm. right? Yes. He's opening up a church mm -hmm. for them people right. in that land. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's what we're talking about. And Ephraim answered Abraham, saying unto him, My Lord, hearken unto me. The land is worth 400 shekels of silver. What did I tell you he was money? He said if he continued two or days more, he is money. So mm. what day did he just give him right here? He said the day, how much is that understanding worth? Four. 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 So what day is that? The fourth day. The fourth day. You see what I'm saying? That's what he's talking about. Right. This is the fourth day of understanding. But mm -hmm. it's silver. It's not gold. Right. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? So mm -hmm. it's it's not full understanding. Mm -hmm. Read. What is that betwixt me and thee? Mm -hmm. Bury therefore thy dead. So what did Abraham say to Ephraim? What did Abraham do with Ephraim? Verse 16. He converted sorry. him from he converted him. Mm -hmm. So what did Abraham do? And Abraham hearkened unto Ephraim. So he listened to that doctrine. And Abraham weighed to Ephraim the silver. So he started correcting it. He weighed it, meaning he went to two precepts. Bye bye. Yeah, he, and he started correcting it. Bye bye. He weighed, he weighed the fire. Mm -hmm. He weighed the fire. He started yes. saying, now nah, what is what is what is the hand? What is uh -huh. the land? Mm -hmm. What is the field? He was doing, that's what Abraham was doing. Because okay. the dude was silver, so he didn't have full, he was re reprobate silver. He okay. wasn't full gold, he's reprobate. Yes, he right? reprobate. Mm -hmm. Which he had named the Lord's word mm -hmm. in the audience of the sons of Heth mm -hmm. for a hundred shekels of silver, current money with the merchant. Why do you say current money? So what were they talking about? Current doctrines. What was the latest doctrine that he was teaching? That's what they were going over. Mm -hmm. He was correcting all the latest doctrines that came into the church. Mm -hmm. That's what Abraham was doing. The merchant was who? Who was the one that was telling him? Yes, Abraham was Ephraim. showing the doctrine. Yes. So Abraham listened to him and corrected his doctrine. The, the mm -hmm. current doctrine they had on the street with the merchant. So he corrected Ephron and his church. That's what it's basically saying. That's what a merchant is. A merchant is somebody is the head teacher. Yes. You guys understand? You guys yes. Yeah. Yeah. Is it lost? What's that? We do. Let's go. Let's go. To, I got another one. Let's make it easier for you. We got it all day. Let's go with uh with Joseph. When Joseph got sold to the merchants, right? The Midianites. Y'all remember that? Yes. Mm -hmm. Vaguely. All right. No, it's Ishmaelites. Here we go. <clears throat> Genesis 37, 27. Mm -hmm. Come, come and let us sell him to the Ishmaelites. Ishmaelites. Sell that understanding to the Ishmaelites, right? And let not our hand be upon him. Uh-huh. For he is our brother and our flesh. Uh-oh. He's of the, he had the same doctrine. And his brethren were content. With the word that they had. So what happened? Then they passed by 
Midianites merchantmen. So they were teachers. These Midianite merchantmen are teachers. They're selling you doctrines. And lift it up. Buying and selling. Mm -hmm. And lift it up. Joseph. And And they drew up. Excuse me. And they drew up and lifted up Joseph out of the pit. So what did that happen right there? What, did, what, what was happening? They drew and lifted up Joseph out of the pit. The pit is carnal. Mm-hmm. Right. Yeah, correct. But then they turned it to a spirit tool? Yes, he can, he can lift it up Joseph. So now they start, started teaching that doctrine out of that carnal. See? And so Joseph to the Ishmaelites for 20 pieces of silver 20 pieces of silver so how much how many days of understanding did they get 20 days no no 20 no 20 pieces two two days yes. their second day of understanding which was what silver silver so it was see it was carnal it was it's not gold yeah yeah so he sold it they taught the uh, the, um, the doctrine of Joseph to the Israelites only and two they- days worth Mm-hmm. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And they what? And, and they brought Joseph into Egypt. They brought Joseph into the carnal, into oh. captivity. So they started using that doctrine, that two days work. So that's when mm-hmm. you see that thing like the meme that says water is the word. Mm-hmm. But then water means something else when they teach again. Yes. Right. So they took yes. that spiritual understanding and brought it into the into the, into Egypt. So you got right. oh, the law, the light is the law. Right. You know what I'm saying? You got the, the water is the word. Now, now yes. it's something really. It's, yes, it's something really heavy going on with this because it's talking about now, okay? Because mm-hmm. what's, ha- what's happening is jo- uh, Joseph's brother. Now, y'all know Joseph is is the top doctor. That's Jerusalem, mm-hmm. all right. So now here that here go his brothers who jealous of him. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hint. One of the camps around here teaching Joseph. The rest of them teaching kind of foolishness. Y'all kind of get what's going on? Yes. Yeah. And so what they doing is they yes. stealing uh, these y'all, doctrines. I'm about to touch on that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm about to talk about yeah. the, I'm about to, because, yes, I want to add in on that, too. Yeah, mm-hmm. they taking the doctrines. They Be taking careful. the doctrines. I mean, not you, Elder. Yeah, I know what you're saying. Yes. They taking the doctrines that we teaching. Right, but they ain't got the full understanding of it, right? So they only teaching a small portion of it, but it's causing confusion mm-hmm. to the people because they saying that the doctrine that they teaching is spiritual, which they blaspheming because yes. they lying to them people. Right. Y'all see that? Them people ain't, they getting the second day. They claiming that they teaching the spiritual. They still in the Mr. Corner because they confusing the people like he said with that uh that thumbnail of that man standing up there like he walking on water. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Mm-hmm. Y'all see that? that? that Go ahead, yes, that's, 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 that's that uh, what the enchantment. But mm-hmm. the thing is that you know when those boys uh, tore Joseph coat off of him? Yes. Right. Mm-hmm. They was jealous. His own brothers did. They did. Yes. Mm-hmm. They stripped them of his doctrine. Mm-hmm. That's what they're going to try. Try and do. To do yeah. to mm-hmm. That's what they yes. tried to do to me. They tried, mm-hmm. to, they tried to do with Elder King Yohannan mm-hmm. by rebuttal. Um, um, Nathaniel, especially Nathaniel, they'll make a video <laughs> trying to confuse us back to strip. Right. Mm-hmm. This Jerusalem doctor can't play right. that game here. We got I this doctor. I mean, we got this doctor, but that's what they're gonna try. His own brothers did that, remember? Right. But um, he what got it back. Call? What you got, Patricia? Joseph got no, it back. But when they qu- stripped I... him of his goats, that's mm-hmm. what they did and threw him in the pit. Mm-hmm. They kept attacking him. They kept yeah. attacking him mm-hmm. with a continuous stroke. Right. Mm-hmm. See that. Right, mm-hmm. had that man yeah. confused. Yes, you know what I mean. Yeah. And they gonna yes. try to intimidate yeah. you. Yes. They intimidate. I've yeah. been in the truth longer than I'm. You older than blah blah blah. But don't go for that. Yes, don't go for it. Go ahead, El. Go ahead, Patricia. I have a question. My question is: Okay, we all know <clears throat> that you know the Bible is all doctrine. 
My yes. question is, because someone asked me the question, how do you take a doctrine, how do you take what the Bible says and incorporate it into your own words and add stuff in that you want to add in and get a congregation? Okay. That's, a whole That's what he said? Like that. No, 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 no. There's, there's more questions. I can answer it. I can mm-hmm. answer it, you know. But yeah. if you got precepts. <laughs> Who's that want to preach literature to speak knowledge too? Mm-hmm. Yeah. <clears throat> Malachi 2 and 7. For well, the <laughs> priest's lips should keep knowledge and they should seek the law at his mouth. Mm-hmm. For he is the messenger of the Lord of hosts. So if this person is not keeping the law and you already read you the law here about somebody speaking two or three witnesses. Mm-hmm. So they're automatically not doing that. There's no reason why they should be teaching. They have no understanding. So because they can't they can't prove anything that they they, they have in their doctrine. Mm-hmm. Because that's why like you can they say something and you can ask one question and they're 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 flustered. Mm-hmm. Right. Unlike you, somebody can you you somebody say, Well, what is the law? You'll be like, Okay, the law is this. You can go to the priest up to show what the law is, and you have no fear of it. So you don't get bothered by somebody asking you the question because you already know. That's the good right. that's the good thing about the peaceful part of the all knowing. So somebody trying to get a congregation together and doing all that, if they're not doing this basic thing and dying and 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 understanding the spiritual truth, you should not be listening to them. That's somebody actually beneath you. Mm-hmm. It's like, why would you listen to somebody that you're greater than? Right. But this you know is the thing. This is the thing. What's happening now, and you know, it's it's a it's a slow process because it goes according to the Most High's will. Mm-hmm. Whenever whenever people start when like we start making these videos challenging what is the the norm of what the bible's saying right right? it's a couple things that we keep (laughs) keying on we keep keying on two or three precepts that's the thing they can't get by because it's in the book and the most high made the prophets write it in there so that in our time it's a latter days book the people mm-hmm. going to hear the doctrine and they going to learn this is w- what you say in order to scrutinize whether or not that person telling the truth or not. Right. When them people start asking for those uh, those precepts, those guys are going to start running. If somebody's trying to correct, trying to trying to add something to manipulate somebody to get them to follow them not out of uh, out of altruism but because they want to have a big congregation the people need to know if anybody is telling you to follow them you have the right to say show it to me in the bible i need two or three precepts to prove every matter that you're talking about don't come over here and give me a a a, a, a scripture that's got 15 verses in it and right. then go and get another one that's similar, got 15 verses. But all the words here, we are reading these 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 verses, and three or four words in each verse mean something else. So mm-hmm. that don't work. You got to be able to break it down specifically according to those words. Mm-hmm. And the people have to know. Ask that question. Show mm-hmm. me two or three precepts so that I can believe that it's of God. If you ain't got that, don't even waste my time. And nine right. times out of 10, that person gonna run cause he lying. He's lying. First, first, Peter, first Peter 4, 11. All right. Mm-hmm. And Patricia, uh, a prophet is Patricia. I'm telling you, your understanding is gonna be so superior. I'm telling you, it's gonna be so superior once you guys start teaching, he's gonna get an increase if you mm-hmm. keep yourself humble. Mm-hmm. Keep yourself humble. He'll get mm-hmm. an increase. He will give it. First right. Peter chapter four, verse eleven. If any man speak, let him speak as the oracles of God. So that's telling you. The man got to come with precepts. Mm-hmm. All right. That's what we're talking about now. That just is this is the absolute correct 
scripture to bring for this because the oracles yes. of God are the two or three precepts. Mm -hmm. Matthew 18, 16, and 20 tell you when you provide those precepts, Christ said his understanding is in the midst of those two or three precepts. All right. Those are the oracles of God. If mm -hmm. any man minister, let him do as of the ability which God giveth. Now, if you got somebody up in here, he's some young upstart, but he want to be the, the head of a, of a church or something like that. That dude ain't going to do nothing but cause people to lose their salvation because he don't right. know enough. Right. All right. He needs to it. take the time to learn how to bring this thing out. Like Elder Sam is telling y'all, it's a certain way the most high want it done. You can't just go yeah. up and down yes. and just do what you want to do. It's a certain way. Because we sitting up here showing y'all and what Moses I said, well, you at this day when you able to do this. You at this day when you able to do that. You at this day whenever you able to do that. They don't know what that means. But the right. most I know what it means. And he gave the understanding to the prophets, the real prophets, to tell you, you at this level here. You at this level here. Well, we gave you the example. He said, be fruitful and multiply. All of a sudden, y'all multiplying all these darn precepts out here. Mm -hmm. Y'all multiplying. Yes. Y'all mm -hmm. see? So... Yes. That God in all things be glorified. He don't care about some chump trying to start a start a church. Most mm -hmm. high say he want all the glory. He said he don't want no God before him. Right. He said, I want it all. I'm jealous. Don't come mm -hmm. up in here trying to be the big dog. Because it's me. It's my doctrine. I wrote this. Mm -hmm. That God in all things may be glorified through Jesus Christ, to whom be praise and dominion forever and ever. Amen. So that's what that means. Go ahead, Elmer. <clears throat> All right, so, uh, oh, oh, you about to say something? Uh, I was continuing. <laughs> Are you what yeah. you got, Elder? Another one. Okay, what you what you, what you got? Where we going? Where we going? We going to Elder Samuel here first. Second yeah, Elder. Yeah, Elder Samuel going to say something. Yeah. Go uh, yeah. to, uh, and it's a process of teaching, mm -hmm. but it's it's it's. Probably gonna take a little more time, but uh, for Gina 22, because I'm I'm showing you what y'all y'all been promoted by the Most High. I'm telling you, He give the promotion. Okay? What book again? What increase. book again? What book again, Elder? Deuteronomy chapter 14, and verse uh, three. I'm just showing. You still going on with the class, Elder? Yes, sir. Uh, yes, sir. Yes, okay, sir. okay. You still doing it, huh? Yeah, I even got to the. Tithe and offering, yeah. I'm just showing you what money and merchandise is. Okay, well, well I'm gonna mm -hmm. show you what tithe, a tithe is too. Just okay. one, one, yeah. But I, I've been enjoying it. Cause see, at the same time, believe it or not, when, when, when someone give a class, uh, when I be looking down, I be trying to penetrate that wall. Mm -hmm. I told you what the one of the prophets, the Most High, told one of the prophets. He said, mm -hmm. "Build that out, mm -hmm. not tear it down. He can right. tear it down, and that's what I do. So the wall is built." Mm -hmm. But read that right there. Deuteronomy 14 3. Thou shalt not eat any abominable thing. Nothing. Don't eat anything. Learn anything abominable, right? Mm -hmm. Don't lie. Drop that down. Don't lie. Drop down to 22. <clears throat> this y'all right here today. All of us. You know, I was coming to this. This is in my notes. I saw all praises. <laughs> Said it was in your notes. It's in my notes. Yeah, all praises. All praises to the most. No, I actually, I was going to write good, good. All, all, right, all praises. Right. All praises. Thank you. It's right here in my notes. Yep. Deuteronomy chapter 14, verse 22. <laughs>